But did you break up with him because of that? I broke up with him because he Probably wasn't stepping up in no field. Reasons, but that was the with no field. That it. was that was the main like that was the umbrella we was under. And it wasn't because like, like we were speaking about yesterday, right. women fall in love with, especially with a man that doesn't have or not on the same level as her, she falls in love with potential. So when mm. you fall in love with potential, you fall in love with, I know this nigga could be a beast. She's I know not how he is. for me. When, I've never fell in love with potential. No, I've never fell in love with potential. Because honestly, I hate him. Sometimes, sometimes, no, I fell in love with potential. Sometimes you tell me potential. You might be able to get a couple of bricks? No, no, no. No, no, no. no. That's different. <laughs> This <laughs> hot fuck, trap trapper turned smack rapper. Only smack rapper that you know is smack rappers. Got bars I can hang with the backpackers. Trap star, I don't hang with the backpackers. I'm in the hood with the work you heard. Making fiends leave earth you heard. Got your baby mama thirst you heard. Feel the flow, nigga, throw it in reverse. This the way you need to surf you heard. Told Jim I need a bomb I could drop on you niggas. Bad boy, I'm never gonna stop for you niggas. I don't give a fuck who you got as the illest. I solidify my spot with gorillas. Now I'm rock with you niggas. We back, <laughs> my expert opinion. This is gonna be a good one. Yeah. We're doing a men versus women episode again. Yeah. They didn't learn the first time. <laughs> That's what's up. That's what's up. Yo, shout out to the subscribers. Hit that like, hit that share. Let everybody know you in here. It don't cost you no paper unless you a mother hater. Gladiator number one. <laughs> <laughs> This is Sparta. No. Oh, nah. This is Sparta. Mm -hmm. Are you not entertained? <laughs> Yo, Mac, what up? Salute, King. S.O. What's poppin'? Shout out to the guys. There's no ladies. See? Women don't support each other. Uh, <laughs> King <laughs> Goddess Bow. in the building. Bow. BK. <laughs> and we have the lovely. I got to give it up. Yo, you got your own street now? Yeah, uh, I'm in the Bronx. I have a street sign. Oh, wow. That's what I that, that, so you, you think you're better than us? No. That's what's up. That's what's up. I don't. Listen, we got the legendary Remy Ma in the building. Thank you. Why didn't you tell me it was, it was men versus women? Why didn't you tell me that? Ah, I did tell Wait, you that. Did. Yo, I hate. I'm going to say it hate, again. Before you tell me what you hate. I hate when I'm talking to you and Essa <laughs> I just want to say that. We did. We did what? We did. I don't talk to you, Essa. When you, I talk to your team. No, I told that's the men not versus women. To I told the men versus women. Man, when we talk, you talk to me, right? right. I talk to you. So when, right. we, when you say, I told you, uh -huh. you did not tell me that. I did tell you. Think you about told how... me who to bring. You said, yo, bring... Um, I said I could try to bring two people. Right. He was like, oh, we only need one of them. And I was mm -hmm. like, all right. But then that's when I had in mind that we were planning like a future day. I didn't know it was like supposed to be yesterday. And then it's like, you know, today they was wasn't, last They minute. wasn't available? It was last minute. Like they, they, I have a battle next week. They're all still like crunch time, writing, rehearsing. Yeah, I know what Shout that's out like. To I didn't want to yeah. pull them out of that element. Like, no. Mm. Actually, I don't know what that's like because I, I write the week of. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm this sorry, is the week of. Uh, this is the week of. Uh -huh. Well, it's the eleventh, you know, right? I could have, I could have forced it. Yes, it's the eleventh, as so. mm. How are you today, sir? I'm doing great. <laughs> Wait, you'll, you'll be back in town for that, I, right? I'm so, I feel so oh, much better than you. Yeah, you'll be back yeah, in town for the eleventh. Well, right? can can your people, your team, put us on the list this time so we can come to the battle? No, you can buy tickets. There you go. Uh, so we doing we. No, here. I, I, I so it. Okay, 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 go ahead. Why not? I'm, I'm here probably supporting, know the security but I'm anyway. here supporting your expert opinion, opinion right? Like, yes. like I'm don't, here supporting this. That don't cost send, you no paper unless did I, you're the motherfucker. Did I, send you an, <laughs> did I send you an invoice? I have my security over there. I have to pay him. I had to get my hair done and my makeup. My boots is my clothes is not cheap and I have a car service outside. I didn't charge anybody anything. Mm -hmm. And if it cost me a ticket to come here in order to support, that's what I would do. You heard the woman, that's all. Oh, nice. Okay. All right, so I appreciate that. Let's start with the first question. What's the first question? Why are women always late? <laughs> Why are they always late, son? Women is not always Why late. She always late. Always the reason. Always her hair's done, her nails are done, her makeup's done, her clothes ain't cheap, she got uh, security, she got a Women is service. not always late because I was on time, so I stand for all women. I care for 
You know what? That did that did make me kind of check. Like, twice. She, I wasn't twice. She. I, don't I was know. not. Tired. <laughs> All right, my woman is out there. If, if we're gonna ask the question, why are women always late based on today, it would also be why are men always last it's minute. Many plans stuff last minute with plans, like. Because we're the leaders. No, like, you're not the leaders. The problem yeah. is y'all don't think for oh, everybody. Like to be spontaneous. You no, you think for yourselves. And as for men, you can throw on a jean jacket, a t-shirt, a hat, and go about your business. Right. Women is a little bit more preparation. Mm-hmm. Gotta, all right. So what stops down. y'all from preparing in time to be on time? When the men don't give us that time, that, that lead time that we need. No. No. Yes, no, absolutely. If I, okay, how long does it take you to get ready? If I know that I'm going somewhere, about an hour, maybe an hour and a half. Right. If how a man says I'm coming at eight know. o'clock, mm-hmm. do you are you out by eight o'clock? If he tells me at six p.m., no. Yeah, no. but you said it takes an hour. Yeah, I said possibly an hour, hour and a half. It depends. Where am I going? You just moved to go about it. You just moved to go about it. You just moved to go about it. You just moved to two hours. I had a whole other outfit planned. Right. I went outside and it was raining. The shoes that I had on was not touching the rain. I don't care for nobody. It wasn't happening. <laughs> Operation back in the house, be back at square one. What am I putting on? Because those shoes is not making it to the rain. Another hour happening. to change the shoes? No, it's not another hour to change the shoes. It's to change the shoes, the dress, the hair, the makeup. Everything changes. Your hair does not, your hair has to go with your outfit. You can't just mm-hmm. have any hair, dude. My hair with goes with all my outfits. Ugh. Yeah. You a man. That's the point. Yeah, this- my hair goes with all my outfits. Don't come off. Now, women with dress, they do the same thing. Yeah. yeah. They, I don't know. No, they be changing their shit up. They be putting twists, braids, they should. put it up. They change their shit up. They should. I don't, I don't know. That's, <laughs> that's just my opinion. Oh, this nigga. Yo, I'm sorry. I got to laugh. Did I miss something? What happened? No, because I told somebody... Yo, we waiting on Remy, and he was like, oh, I got time, time to, to get, get there. Yeah. And he said, I just pulled up. <laughs> <laughs> she ain't probably funny. <laughs> now, I commend women because you guys do do a lot to look good mm-hmm. for yourselves. Because yeah. half the time, we don't care about Not for all us. that stuff. We, we really don't. No, half the time, we don't. Like... No, honestly, like, what are you, what are you, so what are you, you really were looking for? Here, right? And I came an hour late, and I look trash. You not gonna be t- you, y'all will be talking mad. No, if you like, was on time and you look trash, I might overlook looking trash. Yeah. It'd be like, nah, right. nah. She, Even on time, you would have been like, yo, like that's how she had to. You, you showed up like that, like that's crazy. No, where we are is that you look trash argument. Like y'all think you look trash. We think you look fine. Right. You're beefing with you. You're not doing it. We're now telling we, you. We beefing with other bitches ma'am, that ma'am. we don't like. And we, <laughs> don't, and we don't know them hoes. So right. we don't, we don't care, care what about they Y'all think. know them because y'all be fucking Y'all them. do be fucking them. <laughs> you know, you know why? Them. Because they're on time. Nah, <laughs> they show they, up on because time. Because they look trash. It's <laughs> 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 called low They have nothing else to do. <laughs> and they be on time. Yeah, but they show up with the essentials. They show up with the essentials. That doesn't stop them from getting the attention. You agree with this, Lex? <laughs> that doesn't stop them from getting the attention. <laughs> no, the, the fact is, nine times out of ten, when y'all are getting ready, that that's not for. I mean, I can uh, I can appreciate when it's for us, but when we when I'm ready to go, just get dressed. Nah, I'm put I'm it really, in a ponytail, throw some jeans on. Let's because go. I asked the question, but like you're talking to somebody who's been married for 14 years. Most of the time, when I'm late, it's not because of me. It's because of, you see my wallet? You see my watch? You see my keys? Oh, I don't but y'all always know where stuff is at, belt? so I can't, I can't get see, mad at that. We don't be knowing where shit is at. We know where it's supposed to be at. Yeah. Once you move it and put it somewhere else, it's now I don't over. know where it's at. I know where I told you to put it. I know what spot I set up for it. It's right. not there anymore because you put it somewhere else. Right. Had you put it in the spot that I set up for, you wouldn't be asking me all these questions. I promise you, mm-hmm. nine times out of ten, when I'm walking out the door, I have to find a belt, a wallet, some piece of jewelry or another, whether it's a ring, a watch, a chain, a specific hat, like my ID, the most my keys, my ID, the <laughs> random most random shit. You seen the dog um, collar, like stupid shit. I'm not mad at that. So I'll a lot of times that. when I'm late, 
it's because I'm running down the list or we'll be ready to walk out the door the whole time I'm being rushed. Come on, let's go. You ready? You almost ready? I'm ready. Now I'm ready to walk out the door. It's like, oh, I got to walk the dog. Fucking walk the dog the whole time I was, I was getting, getting ready. ready. Mm -hmm. Like I don't, I don't understand. Like it just dawned on you That's, right now. That sounds like a personal thing because most nah. of the times they are. Yeah, it's y'all. No, it it's don't. It don't be. It is. I promise you, I've I mean, had the same conversation with other married women and other women in that long, bottle. you know, standing relationships, and they go through similar things. Mm -hmm. It's just this false narrative that was it's created that narrative. women that women are always. Late. It's not no. false. Every was guy. I late last time. What? No. What? I was late last time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was. Yeah. yeah, but they told you a different time. Yeah, so yeah. we didn't. Try Your team before. again. Because yeah. they told yeah. you nine o'clock. No, 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 90% of the time, if they pulling up in front of a girl's house, they waiting. Facts. She don't come out immediately. Let's well, take the survey. Has that ever happened to you? Definitely. Mm -hmm. Has it ever happened to you? Has it ever happened to you? Has it ever happened to you? Has it? Oh, Y'all corny. <laughs> How about you, sir? Y'all oh. corny as hell. Yeah. Next question. That hard. Next question? <laughs> Next question. That was a fake question. Right. That was, that was a fake question. Edit that whole part out. That was just... <laughs> that was just <laughs> warm everybody up. Edit that whole like, part out. People Edit be late in general. That's, really? That was weak. Uh, you, you brought a question. All right, don't ask me the question yet, don't. What do you mean, don't ask you? you have, yeah. It's your own personal I got, question? I got to think about it again. Go you got to think okay. about it. Mm -hmm. There you go. <laughs> All right. Since you're married, right? Mm-hmm. Married, married. If a man proposes to a woman, she turns down the proposal. Mm -hmm. Is the relationship over? No. Mm -hmm. Really? Fucking right it is. <laughs> For the is man, the relationship over. over? For the man, it's over. <laughs> but, but why? <laughs> is it over? Why? Huh? Why? Is it... why wouldn't it be? Uh, wow. What, am, what are we doing? First of all, because it depends on the time that they've been together. It depends on what they've been through together. Well, she's not ready yet. Like, but she's ready to be in a relationship? A lot of niggas prematurely propose. Like, no. What, what's the difference between a relationship and marriage? If we're not living together, what? it's a lot. That's a real question. Yeah, yes. what's the, yeah. What's the it difference is. What's between the difference? a regular relationship and, and marriage? marriage? Well, one, um, there's binding ties legally, spiritually, mm -hmm. all these things you make. You, yeah. So spiritually, that don't happen like, until no, you get I'm married? No, I'm just saying, like, yeah, when you're different. in a relationship, you're not sitting there asking God... And God's like you know when you say your vows, there's things that depending on what denomination you are, but most right. of them include some form of you know pact that you guys make with God, and there's a legal binding as well, right. paperwork that entails. Sometimes you can change your name or not in a relationship. Like if you decide it's over, it's, it's over. It's, it's over. Mm -hmm. That's it. Like well, it depends unless you're dealing with a fucking psycho that they just don't know what. And over that is. just that. But, um, <laughs> That sounds that like uh Yes. Just let the restraining order go. No, I'm oh, hell yeah. That's OG. 100%. Yeah, no, that's just, so just, just Guys just are out here getting restraining orders on yeah. Twitter? Yo, we, they, yo. We you see what happened to Charlie Depp? Here. It's wild out here. You think because we don't make songs about it, it don't happen? Like, 100%. Yeah. Three, three years. So how does years. that work? You go to the precinct and you sometimes like, Guys, please, this is <laughs> well, right. And I've been dating this crazy for years. I'm over after her they crazy stop shit. Laughing, and they follow the paperwork. Yeah. Like See, I'm over this crazy shit. I've been dealing with it for it's, years. It's, it's it's that kind of it's that kind of like shame and insult to it Dang. that makes dudes not want to do anything. Right. Mm. And you, now you just got to deal with this crazy chick who is hell bent on burning your life down. And if you can't go to the cops what to do that, and that is number <laughs> one the problem. Do? Did I ever tell you how men exist under the assumption of guilt and women exist under the assumption of innocence? Absolutely. Oh, you don't. You don't have to tell me. I what did you oh, do? I live See, I'm not trying to answer that the question because I've never met. I've I've never met a chick. You who have. Went crazy no, for no I reason. haven't. It's you always have. funny. They don't you, ever know a girl that does do this. Anything. She's not going to you tell didn't you. Do Nothing. You that justifies her burning you my the, life down? You were the perfect gentleman. I, I shouldn't have to be perfect in order not to be harmed. Why is my bar 
perfection in order not to have my life I'm taken apart. I'm not saying that it's perfection, but you I'm did saying, say it's perfection. No, I said you what said you did were the you perfect do? boyfriend. Yeah, you were a perfect gentleman. Yeah. I don't have anything. to be. I shouldn't have to be perfect in order not to be wrong, fucked that up. That could warrant certain behavior. No, 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 Okay, no. so what? That's can, rewarding no. bad behavior. No, no, no. Put, put no, the show on the other not. foot. What can a woman do that warrants a man doing something to her? A right. lot of shit. Yeah. Name, no, of shit. name it specific. Okay. The way okay. she dresses. No, it's the no, way no, she dresses. The way she dresses. It could. Nothing. It could. Hmm. How? Maybe How, I want to say the way she dressed because to me, I feel like that's just a whole, that's an insecurity on his yeah, part. Yeah, I agree. But maybe mm-hmm. the way she behaves when she's dressed a when certain she dresses way. Certain, when mm-hmm. she outside. Maybe the, the, the way she's interacting with, with other, other men. men. All right, hold on, hold on. You that's, say warrant. What? Let's, let's switch that warrant word with justified. Right. Warrant, justified, similar. That it's, justified. No, it's not. No, warrant, it's, warrant could, you know, it, all right, that could happen. Justified mean it should happen. Well, I, I like Warrant better. It just shouldn't happen. <laughs> it shouldn't no. happen at all, no, right? No, it could happen. I like the fact that it could because you got some men that they don't care how they women dress or how women, if you got women that they Or know, they're like, into it. You know, my girl's flirtatious or she's this mm-hmm. or whatever, but that's me. I'm cool with that. You got some guys that that'll literally send them off the deep end. Mm-hmm. Like, that and war- I feel, that war- and so when the girl, a lot of times when the women's like, and then he just went crazy. No, bitch, you did bitch, you, Nobody just goes crazy unless mm-hmm. the person is already mentally already ill. Already mentally, yeah. You did something that triggered them. You did something that caused it. So even though you're sitting here saying like, "Yeah, I wasn't perfect," and who I, do I have to? No, you don't have to be perfect, but you have to be careful what you promise and what you do in these relationships. A lot of times, guys just talk because they have fucking lips. They don't. Think about what they're really saying, and women, yeah, they just talk because they have lips. And women don't do that. Yeah, women do it too, they and do. that's why oh. they end up sometimes with cycles. I, I'm, I'm a firm believer in both sides of the coin. Like mm-hmm. I feel women do it and men do it. A lot of times, women because they want something, they'll say certain shit that they really don't feel, and then when the guy is reacting a certain way, it's like I don't know why he's acting like yeah, bitch, yeah, he is because you <laughs> sucked his dick from the back, you just <laughs> acting like crazy, <laughs> crazy. let put it in there every hole because yeah. you wanted to get X, Y, and Z, and now you over here with this nigga and he's thinking you're doing the same, same thing, thing to him. and now he wants to kill you. Right. Stop acting like you don't know why he wants to kill you. Right. Like I think. That's that's the problem that people have. People be in denial about what the issue is. So again, what did I you bring do? That back. What did you do? I ended the relationship, which is what her behavior wanted. No, no, no. Which is you, the you only ended, thing that you can't end the relationship. Did you just I, wake I up can. and it's like you know? No, 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 I didn't say I didn't no, say I woke no. up one look, day. Look, yeah. look, speaking. Mm, what? I've been through some things. Oh gosh. <laughs> What you been through? Yo, tell put, me everything. put the music on for this part. This the violence the and all that. Nah, tell me everything. Listen, I was in a, a relationship. Did she abuse you? With a model, yes. She did. I believe you. She hit you she with the gorgeous. Amber Heard? You see her? You would not believe it. Mm. You would not believe it, bro. Mm-hmm. But she'll start drinking. Yo, that drink. She'll throw on a hoodie. Oh, tie it up <laughs> real tight. <laughs> and it's And then it's... It's like a, a five-hour thing going on, like, and I couldn't take it no more. I couldn't. I didn't understand it. I mean, I understood certain things because she was raised by two Marines, and they used to fight. Mm. So I guess that's something that you know she get she got mm-hmm. in here. Mm-hmm. But when I broke up with her, she came to my crib, knocking on the door. I said, "Yo, I'm not doing this." She said, "Baby, please." Just let me talk to you. And you know, men, we suckers. Yeah, we fall for that. We bullshit. suckers, bro. I fell for it. I opened the door. She had her arms open wide. I said, She stuck I'm you like, up. She punched oh, you in you your face. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like I, I, still, I still love this chick. Bro, she went under my arm and <laughs> bit the shit out of me, bro. Just, ah, just out of nowhere. I was like, oh, what the fuck? And then dip. Because when I initially knocked on the door, you tried to dub me and curb me. I just fucking sit here. So that like, warrants. So you get a bitch. And so that warrants. Huh? That warrants. That warrants. That warrants. No. A piece of me warrants. You missing under me. my arm. You oh, okay, all right. I knocked I hear on the you. door. Let me talk to you. Nah, I'm not with that. Fuck out of here. Whatever. Maybe even you didn't even say fuck out of here. No, not right now. So I had to belittle myself. 
They oh, you had to go home. Yo, you hear this? And then oh, you, you had to do you hear this? Now, now you gonna open the door. Now I'm gonna give you some. Now I'm leaving. Now, now, hold now you gonna bite now, the shit now out now of me and dip down the stairs. But, but I want to ask what that is. Because her humiliation warrants physical attack. See, I'm laughing, but it's not funny. No, listen. Because there's a lot listen, of guys okay. out there Johnny getting Depp? beat the fuck up. I'm going to be honest. I agree with I that. Was in a like, oh, I was I have mind. a son. I mm -hmm. have brothers. I have... My nephew is like... It's like my baby. He's like... I am a firm believer in don't do to somebody what you don't want done to you. Right. Mm -hmm. Like, I've seen girls where they like getting crazy. They spitting. Mm. They swing it all crazy. Like nobody wants to get hit. And I tell women this all, oh, but he 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 know he's stronger than me. You know he's stronger than you too. So why would you punch him in the face? Mm -hmm. Nobody wants nobody wants to get punched in the face. I don't care if your punch <laughs> is not as hard as my punch. Don't punch mm -hmm. me in the face. Nobody wants to get spit on. Nobody wants to get scratched up. Nobody wants their clothes pulled off of them. And there's been this this precedence that's been said. Well, you're a male, and you know you're stronger than her, and you shouldn't do. You should have just been. You should have just walked away. No, she should have just walked yeah. away. Right. Mm -hmm. Nobody wants to be abused. And I have this argument with women all the time. Yeah. It was like I I don't understand. Like you you're supposed to be for women. Yeah, I am for women, but I'm also for what's right first. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I wouldn't want somebody doing that to my son. Yep. I wouldn't want somebody doing that to my brother. Like, and I've seen these women scratch them up, drag them, spit at them, swing them. And the second they get smacked across the street, it's like, oh my God, somebody go <laughs> me. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, I would have been it you. off you. Like, you, you <laughs> lucky. Like, I watched people re restrain themselves. And sometimes it's just a reflex. A lot, especially growing up in the environment that we grow up. If somebody hits you, your reflex is yeah. to go like this. So yeah. I've seen people catch black eyes literally off of a reflex. Like, yo, you, the chick catch him. Bang, in the face. And he's just like... And now she's talking to the cops. Look yeah. at my face. I'm bleeding. And it was literally... I watched it happen off a reflex. And I'm like, you was wrong. But because the way society is set up, you know, as a man, you're supposed mm -hmm. to walk away. No, you're you, supposed to walk away. You're supposed to be the bigger person because you're stronger. Listen, Do man. you think that you feel this way because you had a lot of males around you that you care about? Because it's a lot of women Good that question. don't have males around them um, to actually see this go Good on question. so they can't imagine this. A combination of the two, I think, is some of that. But it's also, I'm just a logical person that I, I, I'm always going to go with what's right. Common sense mm -hmm. kind of like. I would know, like, if I was a guy, I wouldn't want somebody scratching me up, mm -hmm. hitting on me. Like, I'm a woman. I don't want nobody to smack me. I don't even want you to, if you yell yeah, at me too loud, the relationship is over. Oh, you yelling? Oh, okay. Yeah. Like, like I don't want you but, yelling at me. I don't want you talking to me crazy. I feel like if if that's how we have to communicate, I don't want to be it's here. It's not worth it. But, mm -hmm. but to go back to the original question, if a man gets down on his knee, his <laughs> whole family's there. It's not over. Um, and you say no it in front of my niggas. At. It depends on my where you're at. We the, understand the that. Reason no, I, 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 no, no, I can't agree with the that because you to be that's over. almost like a peer pressure situation. No, let me right. help you with something. If the woman not ready, she not ready, let me, you can't force somebody to be fucking ready. Then. then that shows how you not really there for her. That's I, not the bitch you want to marry me because let me, let me, why the, the real question should be, why would you turn it down? No, no, let me ask you this. Women always say, damn, you've been in a relationship for a long time with this man. Why y'all not married? So now is there a time frame on when marriage should come in? No, I don't think it's I a feel like it's frame. based I on think, a bond. I think it's based on who is a in feeling. the relationship. Yeah. yeah. But I could understand why a man would feel like if he proposed and the woman said no, that the relationship is over. Because I I personally believe that it takes a, men are just not out here proposing to people. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. It's just not something that's done. So I believe it takes a lot of steps for a man to get to that point. And men don't like rejection. Yeah. Nobody likes Nobody likes no. rejection. Men especially that hurt they cannot get I know. Uh, uh, no. It makes y'all feel less about me. If I let you, you say listen. no. On to the next. That makes you say no. no. You no. Fuck, me out. fuck you then, No, I'm not. Those I'm messing around. Those, 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 those are not men. Those are not men. Those are not men. If they cursing you out after you say no, those are not men. Those are grown ass boys. We don't claim them. Those are not men. I don't feel like a man. We as men. If you tell a man no and he proposes to you, I don't feel like that's a man. We as men get disgusted when we see men do shit like boys do shit like that. 
issues on the level of rejection. A mm-hmm. lot of times when guys are just hollering at a random chick walking by, they know it's a hit and miss. Yeah, like, right. oh, whatever. Eh, let me just see. Let me let me see if she stopped. They don't even be serious sometimes. Mm-hmm. If you are proposing to somebody, that's different. It's totally different. Like you said, in front of my boys, in front of my family, in front of this, it's a sense of pride that's there now. Because now you're the guy who, look at you, you tried to marry her. Like Because a lot of guys get joked on yeah. because they, they take that step towards yeah. marriage. Right. And she said no. Mm-hmm. Now comes in the question of why is she saying no? Yeah. Is there someone else? Or what's mm-hmm. going on? Like These right. are the things that I know would run through a man's head. They're not thinking of it. Maybe she's not ready. Or maybe this... Um, she has other things that she wants to mm-hmm. do in life, not just relationship wise, just before she's ready to take that step. Because also, there's a lot of things that come with marriage. Marriage is not easy. easy. Mm-hmm. And I think sometimes people get into it for the wrong reasons. Maybe it's something with you that she's maybe not believe that you're ready. Mm. Like, we just got into whatever, whatever this time, and now he's proposing to me. Like, it, I don't think that's what I'm saying. And y'all got to think about as men, when y'all propose to women, y'all not spending your whole life planning your wedding or planning how you want to be when you get married. We, as women, you think about, I don't give a fuck how many women Thank that you. says, that's mm. not true. But, but I feel like I don't care about how many women that says that they don't ever want to get married. It ran through their mind but before. That's why when you say no, it's men, crazy. Hold on, no, there are men that want to get married. That yeah. really think about it for yeah. years. Yeah. They think about it. They but think about it. They just haven't found the person that they feel fits the criteria to be their wife. There mm. are men who be like, yo, when I get married or when I set up, this is what I want my wife to be, this is my suit that I want. Yeah. Yo, old black men, y'all want an all white suit, mm-hmm. want an all white suit. Mm-hmm. Y'all want this. Where you get this movie idea from? All yeah, white suit. For whatever reason, y'all be want to look like the good human ice cream man. I don't know where that goes from. Look at the white suit. Look at I'd be like another white, no, white, white I want to look like Nina Brown when you yeah. basketball. Nice, smooth. Like, <laughs> like, like, there are some men out there that acquire, that aspire to be married one day, mm-hmm. and one yeah. like I don't think. Well, I've never met anybody that wants to die alone. That was like, yeah. you know what? When I get older, I want to be by myself. Well, marriage doesn't guarantee that you won't. No, it doesn't. Nah, but, but it's a good, it's it a doesn't, safer bet. But it gives some sense of security, like, hey, we made vows mm-hmm. to be with each other forever, to death do us part, and sickness and health. Those are the words that set up yeah. for, you know, and and eternity. A long haul. Yeah. Because so, marriage is a big responsibility. I don't think people really realize that, that you got to mm. put... You're, you're, no, you're you now combining to. families now. You don't have to. You don't have to what? You have to, if you believe that. Because you have some people that been married two, three, four, five times. They get married, get divorced, get married again. Like yeah. are, because they 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 don't take it that it's, you have to know how the person that you're trying to marry perceives marriage. Right. Mm-hmm. Because there's some people like with open marriages. There's some people that's like, oh, this doesn't work. Oh, I'm getting a divorce. Like once once you already say that the, the, your marriage is doomed. Because you're already looking at the back door. Yeah. Right. You're already like, if one thing I don't like happens, I'm over there with it. Mm-hmm. So I think you have to understand what the person that you're marrying, what their perception of marriage is. If y'all not on the same page, you're going to have issues somewhere somewhere along the way. So you feel like if a woman say no, it's over? The relationship over? Um, mm. I, I tend to think like a guy a lot, so... Uh, <laughs> yeah. 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 I think yeah. I look at the two, but yo, I don't yo, think yo, so. Because to Remy's credit, everything she said that's running through the man's head when you say no, that's what we run through their head. Yeah. They not thinking about not ready. They like, oh, know. she got somebody yeah, just, else. This ain't like that. Yeah. Whatever, whatever. Here's we the, it, we going it, far it may to not the left. Be, it may not be over, I but... I don't think it'll be... I, I, but, I, I believe but, it's based on a bond. But... You should, if you say no, you should no be prepared bond. for that relationship to end. To, to end. You, I'm not, I'm not guaranteeing <laughs> oh, that. Oh, he's going to cheat right after that. I'm not saying after he's going to be over. Oh, yeah. 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 Don't be shy. Fuck that. Take that. Bleep that. Bleep that. Money yeah. and, and go. Keep that. Yeah. Yeah. Bleep yeah. this guy, man. Bleep <laughs> this guy. And that's exactly why she said no because she knew you was the type of motherfucker that, that fuck with my family. But that's what I'm Listen, saying. Listen, let's not learn them blood or soon to be no, forgotten. If I say no, you go and do some grimy shit, nigga. That's why I said no because no, I don't yeah. trust you. But you, you, know, you mentioned the bond. So you said that there's a bond, right? The bond. So so if there's a bond. And we and we both feel it, and, and, and you, you turn no, me down. down. It's over. Yeah. It's over. Yeah. It's over. You know what also plays into this? A little mm. bit of that talking because you got lips had to have been happening. Because mm. how do you propose to somebody and ask them to marry you, 
not knowing the possibility will be no. I, I not think knowing that, that most that of the times when people propose, they think the answer is going to be yes. yes. Right. 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 <laughs> so if it turns out to be no, somewhere along there was some mixed communication. So, 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 so just to be clear, because I got I got two married people in the building. Anybody else? No. Nah. Just me and what, what are the steps? Gosh, why we keep ending up on this? I want to be there it is. so bad. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are the steps? What are the signs that say, all right, we're ready to be married? I don't know. Let's ask us though. How long have you been married? Two years, and I've been with my wife for 10 years. So we met when we was young. So we kind of like grew together. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So as time gone on, we just had to work out kinks because she had an idea of what she wanted it to be. And I grew up with both of my parents. So I thought that this is how it's supposed to be. And I mm -hmm. had to learn how to merge the two things and work towards the stuff. And when we finally came together and you know, found out that we was going to merge this stuff and we was going to give you a chance and give me a chance and, um, um, and blah, blah, blah. Then we realized that we was ready to go to the next level. You know what I'm saying? Then we, then um, I had proposed to her, and then we still waited for like a year and a half. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Because sometimes people change with proposals. Sometimes people change with marriage. You know what I'm saying? So I thought that out ahead of time. I, I, I fucking managed. So I always planned things ahead. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So when we decided to do it, I said, yo, why don't we just wait? Because we live together. We share finances together. If this goes right, then let's just go take the next step. Mm. Mm -hmm. Smart man. Yeah, that was my process with her. Okay, so that's from a man's perspective. Yeah. You, you felt like, you, okay, <clears throat> having that relationship, that length of time. That's a long, ten, ten, ten years, years is a long time. That's a long years. time to what? Eight you years. Get married. Eight really? years first. Didn't y'all just say no timetable? Ten years is no, crazy. I'm just Why? saying that's long. I ten said, years is I crazy. said I got married. I, 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 I got married after eight years. I've been with her for, for ten, ten years. years. Y'all been married for and ten years. And we was engaged for a year and a half. Is eight years still too long? So that's so really seven six, years. Is it six, six years. About, about six years. Is that too long? I don't know how long it take you yeah. to put in every hole. After that, it's over. Yeah, I was ready. I was ready <laughs> to get married. What the fuck? I was ready to get married to my. But saying no to a proposal doesn't mean a relationship. That shit is crazy. Science. I mean, that could be the first night. That could be the first night. Right? Right? Yeah, we can get married. Like I think now. Nah, I, I <laughs> <laughs> Put it in the I think maker. that people should get married. I, well, not Bleep. think, but oh, I think they should get married when you feel like this is the person that you could live with. Mm -hmm. mm. And sometimes when you do it earlier on, to me, it, it's kind of more better. Like once I've, I've seen people who get married after they've been together for a really long time, they live together. They've had children together. They know each other's whole family. They didn't like you. There's really nowhere to go with the marriage right. because they've done say all of everything, everything. Yeah. that married couples do when they weren't married. Mm -hmm. right. So I, I just think it's cool when you get to experience some of those things with, with your with your partner. Like I literally probably what it wasn't even three years before I got married. And we were able to grow and do all these things. I couldn't, I couldn't imagine being with somebody for that long and then, and then get married. Because it's like, now what are we, we looking do? forward to? Like, that's just my, that's well, just me. What do y'all do? What Who do you man? feel like it's different yeah. now than when you weren't yeah, married? Yeah, when, when you got married, like, what was I the... mean, we had to, we had a lot of kinks to work out. When I first met my wife, I knew that I wanted to marry her the first day that I met her. You know what I'm saying? But... The way she thought about things, you know what I'm saying? I just was riding with her, and she was riding with 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 me through through fucking many things, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? So we had points where we broke up, you know what I'm saying? We not doing this and stuff like that. And then finally, when we moved in together, we got married two years later. You know what I'm saying? Cause we wasn't living together. I had my house in Jersey. I, she was in my condo in um in uh, Harlem. And we were still just trying to work it out because I knew that I wanted to be with her, but it just wasn't right for me. And I didn't want to take that step because I didn't want to get divorced. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I don't want to get divorced. If I did, I would be like, I'm not going to do this shit again. But I never think about it. I just work towards making it better, trying to see, trying to think how she thinks and trying to show her how I think. It's two would totally you ever different get a things. I, I mean, not, nah. Not now, you know what I'm saying? Like maybe when I thought prior 
doing it. Oh, I, I, I probably will if, it, if, 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 if shit don't work. But now, once I took that step, like, nah, I'm not, I'm not looking towards divorce. I'm not thinking about it. It's not part of my language at all. Whether we, are, we fight or whatever, it, do, it doesn't matter. But I've learned to deal with how she wants to do things sometimes. And she learns how I do want to deal with certain things sometimes. Like she just talked to the painter today right in front of Heim when the niggas painting my house. And he was like, well, can you ask him to do so and so? And she said, he don't talk to nobody. And that was the big step for her because she would always be like, yo, you need to talk to him. No, that's not my vibe. And she had to learn that about me, you know what I'm saying? So it was a lot of learning pains and a lot of growing pains that kind of kept us apart. But once we got right, plus she had a kid and I had a kid. Would you ever get married? He was scared. No, I, was, no, I really I, I wasn't scared. I, I, definitely, I, I definitely could see myself mm-hmm. doing it. No, I wasn't scared at all. You wasn't so, you said you knew from the first day you met her yeah. that you wanted to marry her, but you had to work out some kinks and changes, and then you eventually did it anyway. You know, most of the time, it's a guy waiting for the woman to figure out like how to handle you. Because I feel like every woman should know how to work a man. We was talking about yeah, this before. Yeah. Like, men, we know how to... If you know your woman, you know how to work her. You know how to like what, what's gonna make her happy, what's gonna turn her on, all this stuff. But sometimes <laughs> women come into a situation thinking there's a default setting for all men. Mm-hmm. And if I do this, 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 then I'm good. And when and it's it doesn't not like work. that. And it's not like that. It didn't work for me, the stuff mm-hmm. that she was doing. Mm-hmm. You know right. what I'm saying? Like certain things, and she's a family person, you know what I'm saying? But it, you know what I'm saying? So it, it, it was just things that, that was really going on. Because when I knew that I wanted to marry her, mm-hmm. I'm not saying that she knew that. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? So we were still dealing with things that was going on. And she owned fucking lounges. And she works a lot. And she does a whole lot of stuff. And I had to deal with that. Because I wasn't somebody that was like, I'm like, I got money. I don't need you going to work this time. And blah, 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 what? blah. I need mm-hmm. you to be here. This is how I felt. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm right. not saying that it was right or not. And that's and that, and, and those and are things that we had to work way. out. That she wanted to make her own thing. I'm not so worried that was, about was it. It's, it's, it's good that you me. brought yeah. that up. Because um, in this day and age, should is it the man's role to provide? Period. Pro- provide what? Yo, know, she just took a lean back. Because <laughs> I'm dying to hear your answers on this one. Provide I mean, the, what? <laughs> Look, that one was sent me. Everything. Fuck what? you talking about Everything. <laughs> Everything. What? Everything? Wow. You said provide so what? Let me ask you this then. You, no, hold on, hold on. Cause I, cause she's uh, she's going somewhere. Yeah, but no, provide when I say provide what? There is no one size fits all when it comes to anybody. Right. Everybody's on some different wave. What his wife would need provided for her may be a deal breaker for another woman, mm-hmm. vice versa. Man. I'm a loner. I've always been a loner. I'm not antisocial, but I really enjoy my own space and time. What do I need to provide for you? If it, is it physical touch? Do I need to be social with you? Because that might not do it. Oh, you're talking love languages. Oh, I'm you're talking, talking I'm money. Talking, yeah, that's why I say provide what? Because if I'm paying for everything, right? Mm-hmm. But I'm never around because I got to pay for everything. It, it doesn't, you, you're not happy. I've, I've had women in my face with very, very successful men, very successful men, head to toe, done up, don't, they, they don't, don't have to worry about shit, lonely as fuck, mm. because they brought into the life that they thought this is what they want. All their life, this is what they were told would make them happy. Now they got it, they're not happy. But he's a provider. That's all they, he's a provider. Okay, next mm-hmm. question. Could you, could you deal with your woman being the provider? I wouldn't bother me. What wouldn't bother me at all? I don't. I, I come yeah. from a family. Uh, I'm gonna like, keep it real. I come. I, I gotta no. do something. That don't make you feel less I, than a man. Nah, it's different. No, 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 no. If it's Oprah, my nigga. So let me tell you something. I ain't gotta pay no bills. I'm, I'm not paying no real bills. Quick, like right? you, Oprah. Like, get the fuck this out of here. Both ways. All right, go for it. People like to say men and women. Men and women are very, very identical. Mm-hmm. Just mm. different body parts. Very. Yeah, identical. I don't agree with that. But go ahead. Very identical. Okay. If a man, the woman that you're talking about, her man pays for everything, she's fly, she got the nice car, he's this with, you know what you gotta deal with when you don't make a dollar and your dude pays for everything? Whatever he wants. Mm-hmm. 
whatever mm-hmm. he say when he say it. You, How, how's that bad? How is that bad? Because yeah. it, it it comes to where you're dependent mm-hmm. and you kind of mm-hmm. would have to put up with things that you probably may no. not want to mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. or that you may feel is disrespectful to you or you really can't say or do much because you're at this person's whim. His puppet. And I try to explain to women all the time, like my sisters, my cousins, like my friends. It's cool in the beginning when a guy meets you and he want to pay for your hair and your nails and your clothes and take you on trips and pay, buy you a car and do this. In the beginning, it's cool. Right. When you are in a relationship with him now, you are a walking, talking, annoying bill. Mm-hmm. That's what you are. They look at you and like, this bitch need this done, she need this done. Like You're bringing nothing to the table. Everything that I'm doing, like in... Because I'm a worker, I know what it takes to make a certain amount of money. Mm. You become a bill. You hang around too many niggas, son. Yeah, nah, you hang around too I many niggas. I promise you. I promise you. And because women ain't talking like the this. The same. The same. Because they don't think. Mm. Nobody wants to it's do. It's beyond everything. thinking, right now. Listen to me. Nobody wants to feel because. In the beginning, it's courting you. I'm courting you, and I want my bitch to be fly, and I want you to have nice things, and I'm right. giving you stuff. Now, when it becomes, this is my job. Part of the job that I have to do, and my other half of my job is to come and make sure you good with everything that's going on over here, regardless of how I feel about it, regardless of where in the argument. Because it's not like I get in the argument like, bitch, now you're not eating. Now I'm not giving you grocery money. Like, <laughs> yeah, still, that, that's, still, called, that's called financial I'm not abuse. getting your head right, down right. and all that. Yeah, still, they do that. You still have to provide these things. And right. mm-hmm. you start realizing, like, damn. I could technically, especially if y'all not married, I could technically not be with her and leave this no, bitch for dead. And, and I would have this over here. Right. And it's the same exact way if it's the woman doing it. Like mm-hmm. how you said, I wouldn't have a problem with it. Because you think of the shit like, damn shit, I wish I could just sit back. I ain't got to worry about the mortgage. I ain't got to worry about this. My bitch is up and she's just going to pay everything. But there's this thing with women, which we're very much like men. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'm paying for everything. Nigga, if you sh- shut the what? Yeah. Suck your what? And I feel like it. Fuck out of here, nigga. Like, is is she's not gonna be but, Damn, but I can't see it. Men men, men men are not doing that. Men in the beginning. Men are though. I just got out of a relationship like that. In the yeah. beginning, yeah. Yes. What? four and years I was doing everything. Paying for everything, everything, paying every bill, handling my career, everything. And I and would what come, was he I doing? would I would literally come home. And I got two dogs. I would literally come home. Pads got dog shit on it. Clothes is that. Like, what are you doing? You're not cooking. You're not cleaning. You're not doing. I was aggravated after a while because after a while, you know what I'm saying. I'm dealing with politics. I'm learning how to adjust from coming from the streets of Brownsville to now I'm in this music industry and I got to play chess, not checkers. So I'm learning how to talk the talk, and it's aggravating when you in meetings all day long and people trying to prep you and trying to teach you to not say certain things. And I got to go home to a lazy nigga that's. But it's not even that like, he's lazy. He's just home. You and that it's, shit is home. Yeah. It's aggravating. But it seems to you like so, Yo, I'm so, doing this, this, and that, right. and he has it easy. But you said three years, four years, four, four. four years, four years. Damn, you were thugging. Four years. I, I, I we spoke about what? this before. Four years. Four years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He wasn't bringing in no money. None. You know why he wasn't? None. I'm, I'm, I don't want to say no, that's a lazy. No, no, no. But then, but then, but then, oh, but then oh, the, the situation became of yes. you don't treat me like a man. Thank and it's like, how can I treat you like a man? Like, and you're not. That's the point right so there. So when it comes with me, that's when, the point. When we asking about providing, I don't want a man to take care of me. Yes, have my back whenever I need help. You know, surprise me with certain things here and there. But number one, I'm a street ass bitch. I don't need no nigga to take care of me. I'm gonna take care of myself. Anything that I ask you for, I can do it myself. All but right. to have my back. Up, have my security, be that man, yes. And if you that man and you playing that road and you leading me to a ditch, you cannot be my leader. So he didn't, have your, he didn't have your back, that's what you're saying? He didn't have my best interest at all. Why? At you know why? Wait, 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 hold I'm going to tell you why. Why? He didn't care about you. Uh, maybe that was you know why? Reason, you know. And I've said this before. No matter how much a woman is doing, when she's holding a man down, if he cares, he's going to come through too. But that was, he's, it was like something. Like, nigga, I'm getting my he hands dirty, get your hands dirty some That's way, That's why he didn't want to do anything. That's a fact. Mm. But if, I, if I'm fucking with you and you holding me down, mm-hmm. I'm like, I got to do something. She out here thugging on my behalf and I'm just going to sit here? That's what I I'm saying. I give a fuck about That don't make no sense to me. I got to do something. Nah, and for four years. So, so wait, so wait. But you hear what you say? What did you break up with him because of that?
I broke up with him because he Probably wasn't stepping up in no other field. Reasons, but that was the with the no field. That it. was that was the main like that was the umbrella we was under. And it wasn't because like, like we were speaking about yesterday, right. women fall in love with, especially with a man that doesn't have or not on the same level as her. She falls in love with potential. So when mm. you fall in love with potential, you fall in love with. I know this nigga could be a beast. She's I know not how he speaking is. For me, when, I've never fell in love with potential. No, I Sometimes potential. You might be able to get a couple of bricks. No, no, no. No, no, no. Because of the fact right. that I knew what he did and I knew what he do in his element. You understand right. what I'm saying? Men mm. go through certain shit, which we could all account for. Men go through certain shit to where sometimes y'all go through which I go through and y'all have to learn to get through it to the next step. You understand? So right. I understood, like, yo, when I got with this man, he was on his shit. He was bringing the bread and he was doing this, he was doing that. Cool. You went down low, I'm going to hold you down. I have no... You're my nigga. You held me down, I'm going to hold you down. Like, you know what I'm saying? Right. But... It goes from me holding you down from one year to two years to now it's four years. My career's growing. I'm baby, we not in this I'm not in the same spot where I was at four years ago. Right. So you have to meet me somewhere, somehow. You have to help me. You have to contribute some way. And if you can't, it's over. It's done. Now, now let you me go. I wanna add to that because I don't I think she said some somewhere along the um line you said he was like, Oh, you're not treating me like, like a, a man, man right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now the problem with society is that they, they have this misconception that treating you like a man is the man is paying all the bills or the man is providing mm. in like fucking caveman era where the man is going out bashing the animal over the head mm-hmm. and dragging it home. <laughs> right. um, I feel like both parties, in order for a relationship to work, both parties have to provide on everything. Mm-hmm. Mm. Like everything. Financially. Mm-hmm. Emotionally. Mentally. Mentally. Like there right. has to be a balance because everybody's not always like this all the time. There's going to be times where I might have a little bit more money than you have and you're going to have to pick up the slack. There may be times where I'm going through something and I'm stressed out and I'm going to need you, even though you're a loner, you're not really a talker or whatever, I'm going to need you to step up and know that, hey, my bitch needs me to do to talk to her. Mm-hmm. She needs that comfort right now. And right. as a woman, you're going to have to be able to see that in your man. Like, ah, right, yeah, he's a man, but right now... He need me to be a little bit. Yeah, I'm from Brownsville. I'm from Brooklyn. Mm-hmm. I'm from the Bronx or whatever. But he needs me to be that nurturer right that now because soft. that's what he needs right now. And that's the balance that has to come in. And once you understand that in your relationship, you have a relationship, yep. not a part, not a partnership where we're in on some business deal, right. not a sponsorship where one person is doing <laughs> everything. Yeah, yeah. No, that's where right. one no, person that's is doing one. everything and the other person is not doing nothing because it's, whenever it's unbalanced, there's going to come a time where somebody feels that they're being used or they're mm. being taken advantage Lack of, of appreciation. or they're not getting what they feel they deserve to get and then the relationship so, starts so to So let's sort down. this out. What's the balance? If um. If I'm providing, hold on, hold on. If I'm if I'm providing mm-hmm. everything financially, right? What's the balance? What okay, do I get so back? you're coming in literally. I don't have a bill at all. Period. Yeah, you, you don't have a bills. bill at all. So now I have to see the things that do bother you that that you so you don't have to deal with because you're taking away all my financial stress. I don't have to worry mm-hmm. about my mortgage, my taxes, my bills, putting food in refrigerators, food on the table, getting clothes for the kids, whatever doing all of that. Right. So now I have to take away from you all the stress of the other stuff that you would possibly have to do in your life. You shouldn't have to worry about where your, your meal has come from or having clean underwear yep. or running the to house do little errands order. and mm-hmm. things like that because you're doing all the other stuff. Yep. So I, it can't be both. It can't be I'm paying the bills, I'm doing this, and then I come home so and I got to clean crib. up behind the door. Mm-hmm. And this and I dish do is this. in the sink. Right. Mm-hmm. It's like, right. And it's not that I'm emasculating you and, I'm, and you're the housewife now. Because, and, and but you got to play yeah. a part. But it's just like, mm-hmm. I'm doing this over here because so you don't have to deal with it. You have to do something so I don't have to deal with mm-hmm. it. All the stress of the relationship can't be on one person because right. then the relationship is going to break down. What happens is, I think a lot of times, like I said, there's these preconserved no- notions and ideologies of who's supposed to do what. You're supposed to take out the garbage. Yeah, I don't You're believe supposed to that. do the dishes. You're supposed to do the bathroom. You're supposed to do the kitchen. You're supposed to pay the bills. You're supposed to cook. It's it's When you have those things in your mind, it's never going to work. It's whoever does it. Like whoever get home first and my daughter needs to eat, that's who's going to get food. Right. 
whoever, you know, get home and we know tomorrow's garbage day, that's who's going to take out the garbage. We not, I'm not going to, well, I'm going to just leave the garbage day because tomorrow is his day until you go. Like, right. nah. It, and I think a lot of times that's the downfall of relationships where people have placed these, you know, jobs on people that mm. is, is, is not a, a signed job just because I was born with a pussy or because you was born with a dick. That's not my job. Yeah. I fucking hate washing dishes. I will fucking throw them shits away before I wash dishes. <laughs> I promise you. I, I hate it. I I'm just became throwing like that. them in the fucking garbage before I, no I don't like washing dishes. I don't like washing dishes. I will cook whatever you want, but I don't like washing dishes. And that's just something that's not going to happen. So there are times where my husband will come in because he knows I hate doing it. And he'll see the shit crazy. He'll load the dishwasher. Or he'll go out to the store and see like the shit is getting crazy. He'll wash the dishes and he'll get like, you know, the plastic or the whatever mm-hmm. so that if we have company over, he knows I'm not going to want to do the dishes. dishes. So these right. are the things that you have to think about. It's just about, you know, taking care of each other. Like, you can't just one mm-hmm. hand doing this, cleaning the other hand, because this hand, gonna, after a while, this hand going to be nice and soft and pretty, and this hand's going to be dusty and, and yeah, raggedy. Mm-hmm. Right. You have to do this mm. in order for a relationship to work. Uh, do you think that that's learned um, in process? It depends. Mm-hmm. It depends who you're dealing with. You have some people that come from very different upbringings, mm-hmm. and they don't know. Like, and, it, and I'm not even just talking about in a relationship, man and woman in a physical relationship. These people don't even know how to be a friend. friend. Mm-hmm. 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 They've never had real friends before. They don't know how to interact with people, and they're just pieces of shit. And sometimes, yeah, you have to teach them. Like, nah, that's not how you do. That's not what's going on. If you love the person enough. That's what I'm saying. Sometimes it, t- enough, it takes time to work you will, out. You will put in the effort to try to, and I, and I don't want to say change them, but to try to show them a better way to communicate in so that you guys can be together. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And if you're willing to put in that time, then it's okay. But I personally, like, I'm one of those people, I don't want to have to do too much work. Like, I feel like it should just happen. I'm doing all the stress in it to get you to how I want you. Like, this, this is, it's not, it's this not it. It's not it. Mm-hmm. Okay. It. Are there any roles that, um, you know, from, ca- from the caveman days still carry over to this time? I don't know. Are or there, is it a free for? Do you answer any questions? Or do you just ask all the questions. What do you mean? Nobody asked me a question. I got a question. I asked you a long time ago about you. Would you ever get married? You skipped over. Oh yeah, you did. Heard uh, the shit out no, of me. No, I answered it. No, he answered. No, he answered. I answered. You didn't hear it. He would like to do it one day. I heard it. Yeah, I'd like to do it multiple times. I'm not anti-social. You're not anti-social. You're a loner. Let me see. What? Yeah, definitely. 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 And being a loner doesn't mean I wouldn't want to get married. That's. Absolutely means you don't want to get married. No, you're gonna it get married to another loner, and you're gonna have your own house because you want your own space, and you don't want to touch <laughs> yeah, your shit. No, I'm, like, I'm, but I'm not mad at that because you know sometimes yeah. I gotta be yo, yo, yeah, stay over there. Let me ask Remy a yo, quick question. Be over here. Different, yeah. like having Chill. one of your own personal space, but being a loner, like and being married, it's. You would literally have to find somebody that wants to be alone which is, too. Which, my, my no, thing no, is she East Wing, she doesn't, West Wing. She doesn't I need, need that. She doesn't need to be a loner I need too. That. It, being a loner doesn't mean that I don't like people. It just means, <laughs> I dig people. It just means that when I'm by myself, you're really cool. Like cool being by yourself. myself. Okay. So you'll go my, down to your man caves type shit. I don't even do, like, I'm, he knows. After this show is done, yeah, basically. <laughs> All the shit. After the show is done, nine times out of ten, I night. walk back to wherever I need to go because I get to be by myself. I really dig being you by like myself. Mm-hmm. What, I, what I tell people, what I've told every woman I've ever dated, one size does not fit all. Whatever you did for that last dude, whatever I did for the last chick, we're going to have to figure out the way that we coexist. And the only thing I don't want to bring into this is judgment. Mm -hmm. You tell me what you like. I promise that I'm not going to judge you. I'm Mm going to approach this with an open mind. So if you tell me that this is the way you like your relationship, this is what makes you feel protected, loved, warm, safe, all that fly shit, Mm -hmm. and I can do that shit, oh, well, then we rock him. But if I can't do that, doesn't make me the bad guy. Doesn't make you the bad guy. You're not evil for liking what you like. I'm not evil because I can't do that. Though, even though you know you can't provide all that it shit. It depends on what kind of you. fucking she's into. <laughs> 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 depends, on what, depends on what kind of fucking she's into. what you want to ask me? I forgot now. My bad. Really? Mm-hmm. My bad. That's crazy. Really all right, what so, kind of so I got to ask this because... Oh, oh, I do know what I wanted to ask. My bad. 
How you feel about the poly relationships? Oh, you see, you see, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, that was what yeah, you was gonna yeah. say? Because we're because we we're talking and you're saying like a, a lot of these situations don't work. You got to figure out what works for your mm -hmm. partner, what works for you. Mm -hmm. um, there's been studies, of course. You know, the polygamy has been around for thousands of years, mm -hmm. probably longer than. Monogamy. Monogamy. Traditional marriage, yeah. And unless you're Christian, you believe Adam and Eve was just yeah. like, it's just mm -hmm. me and you <laughs> forever. You know what I mean? Um, Cut that out. <laughs> you know? I'll help you. Carry on. All right, all right cool. Whatever. <laughs> it's going to stay in there. I don't know what you're talking about. Um, so with this new society that we got, are we open to that type of thing now? Me? I'm not. <laughs> Everybody. Yo, I'm asking on, everybody. Me, I, 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 but if you want to answer first, be my guest. Well, I want to know why she's not first. What? Um, she don't want to share. Not, not relationship-wise. Like, not bringing nobody else into my relationship. Mm. But I'm into... We could probably have fun once in the blue. Which would you rather be in a poly relationship or grant your man threesomes? Or your husband threesomes throughout the year? Grant him threesomes. I'm Remy? with the three something. I'm not with the extra Remy bond. Remy Grant no damn threesome. Stop. I'm, it, I'm not with the know. extra bond and stuff. I could do the three songs once a year or something. Once, once a year? Fuck. You mean that's in the extension? Hey, we ain't doing three songs. You gonna have a nigga walk around and chill like this? No, no, no. That shit was good. That shit was good. We doing the three something is because I want to fuck the bitch. We're gonna get another bitch. It's not. It's not because. Nah, you can't make it. You don't care about the rules. See, that's why he ain't work for four years. You crazy? First off, that nigga. Stop getting, that nigga stopped getting pussy a year before we even broke up because he wasn't playing with his dog. So, no. Now, now everything comes no. out. I'm paying together all the for bills. I'm do, that was, that was like a good six, seven months. I'm doing everything. I'm paying all the bills. You're not, gonna, you're not making me want to fuck weeks, you. You're not over. being a man. Like, I'm not it's cheating over. on you. So respect the fact well, I'm not cheating on you. Everybody should have been cheating. Everybody he was should cheating. respect the fact. That's like the basic That's duty not no in a relationship. If I'm That's a basic and I'm duty the in a relationship. And I don't can't cheat. come home and talk to you and you can't. No. Mm -mm. You saying respect the fact I don't cheat on you like that's not part yeah, of that. Yeah, because if a bitch, if a bitch, no, because any other, no, because let's be real, any other bitch in 2022 that's holding a nigga down that's not playing his part is cheating. Absolutely. You understand? So respect I, the fact I, I, I was that. not cheating. You, you see what you're saying? That that kind of goes against the 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 logic that you guys just threw out there because no, now you, right. now you're saying that the man definitely has a role. That he's supposed to play, I and if you he's don't play, he's supposed to step up and help. You cheat on him. If somebody's paying for that. every single thing and they handling every <laughs> single thing, thing the other point should that. definitely oh, step okay. up okay. and help. I'm agreeing with you. Mm -hmm. Oh, so hundred percent. This, this is how I feel about. That. First of all, I don't think the reasons and great and your man having many a year you allowed him to have. That's mm -hmm. not polygamy. Polygamy is people who are married mm -hmm. and they have multiple wives, mm -hmm. and it. It goes back in history that the only people that were able to have multiple wives are men that were able to provide right. mm -hmm. for, for multiple them. women. Right. For multiple, nobody should be shorted. Nobody should have less than the other. Now, me personally, I don't think I would ever be able to be in a relationship like that because I'm just, I'm a lot. Mm -hmm. Like I, I don't. I, I'm what do you mean you're a lot? I'm a lot to deal with. I, like, I know like that what? I'm a lot to deal with. Like what? Like what the fuck is you? Like you blowing like horns in the morning like, and doing nah. car wheels? Like, like, yeah, no. It's time to serve. Like no, what are you doing? I what the fuck? A lot. Like, what are you doing? I want all of your time. To all your attention. Me. I want you to be mm -hmm. mine. Like I want to possess you. Like I respect like, that's that. How I am. I'm not mad at that. I respect that. I'm not mad at that at all. Because I wouldn't want me. I wouldn't want to share my husband with another wife. I wouldn't want my husband to have children with, somebody else. with mm -hmm. someone else. I just wouldn't. I wouldn't be able to differentiate and be like, oh, today's my day. I'm going Monday, down the hole with the other white. And then mm -hmm. he'll be, even though he's providing for all of us, me personally, my mental is not able to, like, I wouldn't be able to not be jealous. And when mm. I say, and I'm not a jealous person, I just feel like if I committed to this marriage, like, I would want it to just be me and you. So here's a question. I do understand those relationships mm -hmm. where men have other wives and they have these families and they all coexist together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. However, I do think it's crazy that it's only the men. Right. Like, Which why? But why? Why do women because can't have why, multiple husbands? Like, like I would, I, the same way I'm not opposed for it to men, mm -hmm. like, if a woman 
is able to provide enough pussy to go around for her husband over here and mm -hmm. her husband over there. Why can't she have two husbands? And not who's, men. Who's, who's the father? What do you mean, who's the who's father? Who's the father? Yeah. When she gets He's pregnant, pregnant, who's the, the one who's fucking raw? DNA says the same way. Fuck, yeah. him, fuck ass Maury. Fuck yeah, that's some about bullshit. Like, Maury, you gotta wait. Nah, son. But right. it's like, it's not but even... But that's not what women but want, would, but that would, in my opinion. That's not what it would be anyway, because... Mm -hmm. We're all family in mm. these in these po poly Polygony, yeah, yeah. Yeah, relationships. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't be who's ours. the father, who's this? Oh no, that's your kid. No, these are all our children, and we're all one family. Mm -hmm. So it really wouldn't be that that issue. But I just feel like the world would never accept women having multiple husbands and multiple families the way they're able to accept it. I agree. I, 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 don't, I do not agree with that. The girl in Atlanta. Because, bro, listen, bro. Ten years ago, we. If we were, if someone was to tell us, yo, the things that we would accept today, mm -hmm. that's going on right now, that we're like, uh, ah, yeah. But she's talking thing. about right now, man. No, but I'm saying when when she says the world would never accept that. Oh, never. I got you. Well, it's gonna be now, bro. Yo, we, we don't okay, know I'm exactly. Women can't but they, even but they, have abortions if they want yeah. to no more. You think they gonna yeah. let you have multiple husbands? But, but you, but you know what that's you about. Okay, you know what but, that's but it falls into the it's same election thing. year. It falls into the same. It's not just election year. It falls into the same fucking thing. You think we are gonna let you bitches have equal rights? Multiple husbands. We all got kids by this nigga and that nigga and really get crazy. All right. So, so at what point do your basic instincts kick in? And do what? Uh, but yeah, what you mean? Because, you know, most women, they don't want multiple men. Who told you that? See? Y'all used to say I was fucking. I'm sorry, what you said? Y'all used to say I was fucking. Here we go. But the number one thing. No, 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 no. Let him finish. No, 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 Hmm. So you telling me you find a man that's doing what he needs to do, providing for you and doing doing what you need, your desires, fulfilling your needs, your list, checking all the boxes and all that. You still have the desire to step outside of that relationship. Do you not hear me when I told you that men and women the exact same thing? Yeah, there's one different but you're not. Part. We are. We though. are. You right. think so? You find, take me so shopping. Me. Man. So you find a chick. <laughs> I have no shopping. problem with that. Hey, my friend. I have no and problem. And when a nigga jump out from behind the car, like you hear that? I have no <laughs> problem with that. that. <laughs> you know, maybe that's what you need to share. What are you doing? Like, I have no problem with that. What I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to explain to you is the same way you men have women. Like I, I know men that love their girl. If they girl left them tomorrow, they would fucking sign themselves to slit your wrist records and drop their single, I'm killing myself tomorrow. <laughs> and they right. still fucking. And they still, still yeah. go beautiful, yeah. take care, do everything else to it, and they still go. It's not, it has nothing to do with the fact that he loves her less or anything. That's just what it is. Right. Why, why can men not fathom just because you she have got a man up that you don't yeah, you're blind? Because instinct no, because instinctively, we're seed planters. That's what we do. You can't get pregnant by two guys. But if you if you got pregnant, that is not then true. that man can keep continuing. That is, okay, that's not true. That's not okay. true. That's not true. That's not true. That's not true. They tell the Listen whole to me. I'm gonna give you this is planet. A, I'm gonna give you a better Yo, example. Listen to you me. You guys are doing the wrong thing. Wait, I'm, I'm so glad right you brought up. Yeah, let's go. Do, right? I'm so <laughs> glad you brought that yes, up. Yes, yes, go ahead. Let's see. Because if you have, a, let's take lions for for instance, yes. mm -hmm. pride of lions. Mm -hmm. When the woman lion is in heat, you think she only cares about the, the, the one the, lion? The one like. No, she wants the powerful one. Up, but it's up for whoever comes. Like yeah. they're literally coming from and wherever. The dolphins fuck all the males, and so they don't kill the babies. And the dolphins is different. Them niggas pull out. <laughs> like yo, like for what? real. <laughs> dolphins <laughs> is the only other species but on the planet that pull I, out. What, what I'm trying to tell you is that, like this, 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 all of these misconceptions we think that the are same way. fake, etched in stone. Like, and this is why. Guys be going crazy. This is one of the main reasons because he's like, I'm See? paying all her bills. Mm -hmm. I'm fucking sitting in this chair. Why did she do that? She's a whore. No, she's just <laughs> like you, nigga. What the fuck is you talking about? Like, uh, she might be a whore. No, no, no. Remember when we used to switch Joe? Remember when we used to switch Joe Button and Big O's right there? And I was like, chicks are doing this. Y'all bleep me out. I was like, 
No, they not. One, one and one A is telling you Facts. right now what's going on. So let me answer my question. What? If a man is checking all the boxes, you telling me you're still looking like outside of that? Because to my knowledge, personally or just on the broad. To my scope, not okay for women, you guys. You, you, For the most part, you think y'all, women y'all fuck don't with want... this. Y'all fuck with this. <laughs> we don't do that. We don't do that. Like I men, guess. like how many do, do we do that? Math. We don't do math. that. I'm gonna be honest with you, man. We don't do that, man. Fuck for this, man. Huh? But I'm a. I'm a, yeah, but that's different. They, they they come up in different type of conditions yeah, for that type of I'm shit. I'm going to tell you what the problem... Some pro- people, go ahead. some girls just want to fuck. Yes. That's it. Not that's even for money. That's what I'm saying. Yes. Not even yeah. for money. Mm-hmm. Oh, my heart, you got a big dick. I want to fuck him. Yeah. Yes. Oh, he's cute. I want to fuck him. Yeah. Oh, I'm bored. I want to fuck him. Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh, my period is over. I want to fuck him. Yeah. Like, yeah, oh, my period is on. You don't really need it. Oh, my God. You don't really need a reason. This is great. Like, oh, you're never sitting mind. and you're, you're, you're making up reasons as to why. Like, there's really no reason. Women are human beings, beings. just mm-hmm. like men. I, I think. Yes, when we find somebody, do is it is it more noticeable because we wear our heart, some of us wear our hearts on our sleeves, is it more noticeable to be like, all right, she cares about him and this is the person that she wants to be with. So she's like literally tunnel vision on this one guy she don't even see nobody else does that happen but does that also happen with men yes but i think i think we're talking men, about yes. i think we're talking about two different times in life i think that's where the disconnect here is coming in math is very specifically talking about relationship into long term partnership type right. business whereas i believe and correct me if i'm wrong but i believe most of the behavior you're describing from women we're not talking about women in committed situations. Nine times out of ten, Gosh, we're talking you. about women who are oh, so you think still fairly young. Want to fuck the same dick for twenty nine years? Thank you. Oh God. Word. No, no, no. This is what I'll be Tell, trying to I explain, explain to y'all. To y'all. I like, correct that, me that, if that I'm wrong. When we doing this men versus women shit. When we doing the men versus. I've been saying this on all the shows. Y'all call me crazy. Correct me if I'm wrong. Y'all call me crazy for this. I mean, yeah, yeah, but y'all, but y'all seem to think. See, what I know is y'all seem to think that y'all know how women think. I don't. I what, said no, no. That. I said because he no. said women. No, but talking about because you said they deal but with the is, heart and but, all that. But yeah, no, and I, I'm gonna tell you what the issue is. How it's not just about that. The what comes into play is nobody wants to eat frosted flakes every day. For breakfast for the rest of their lives. Now, what you do as a man is you have frosted flakes every day. That's the staple. But now you might have pancakes with it today. Mm-hmm. You may have mm-hmm. grits and bacon with it tomorrow. Like you, you have to, in order for women to be in that space, you have to mentally, you have to, you know, stimulate her mentally as well. Right. Because just fucking. It's so, not gonna okay, do it. so that box is checked also. You still looking? Why are you still looking? So if all the boxes is checked for men, are you still looking? What box? Hold on, hold on. Hold no, on, she on, meant on. for wait, women. Wait, wait, she wait. meant the boxes for women. All of my boxes. Yeah. All of all of yo, yo, <laughs> my, yo, box yo, lady, <laughs> my box <laughs> includes looking. My box includes looking. <laughs> like if you got you gotta be cool with me looking. If you're not, then looking you it's one not thing. gonna looking. You mean looking like physically just looking. Looking or actually no. Engaging no, it, it, outside acquiring, acquiring. That's that's crazy. So how is it crazy? That's no, that, no that's so, one size no, fits so, all. That's so, not so, one size fits so all. I'm asking him. He's he can't fathom that a woman would have a man that all the boxes is checked and she's she still, still looks somewhere him. else. I, I, but that's it's standard. perfectly normal for a man to have. All the boxes checked on his chin. No, the, you guys speak for yourselves. I'm saying one of my boxes is I get to look. I keep saying one size don't fit all. That's Everybody right. has different ways of how they I, deal I with I a relationship. And I keep yeah, saying that there is no that. standard and formal way. What makes her feel good might not make me feel good. Mm-hmm. What you're willing to tolerate, I might not be willing yeah. to tolerate. It just goes round and round. So you wanna so you wanna find a woman who realizes that one of your boxes is looking somewhere mm-hmm. else. That will box, you, but but that, understand tolerate, that box comes at a high price. Will you tolerate price. that box on her list? Um, usually that's just not the case. 
And I and I say that like people ask that's me. That's a no. People ask, him, no, hold no. on, hold on, hold on, that's hold on, hold on. No. Hold on, hold on. People true. ask me no. that question a lot, but I have yet to run into that female that's like. Not that yeah, you know I want to do this, and I want to do this. Well, no, he's but not with Joe, he has, I have a member. If he has, but then he has Joe it. Says doesn't it mean they don't you, exist. Because Joe said poly means that the woman can bring in a man, too. He's, and you was he like, He said polygamy, no. not yep. polygony. Okay. Yeah, That's what he di- said. Yeah, different different joints. Well, right. But Joe ain't going for that shit either. So I don't even... <laughs> no, 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 he, he wasn't saying that, that he wasn't going for I'm just saying that... Everybody, Listen, everybody's We talk a lot about balances. But... But you At the feel end of the that day, men should have rights that women don't. Mm-hmm. No, not not rights. Yeah. But women have a privilege that we could never experience. What is that? And that's giving birth. Mm-hmm. We could never experience that. I we might, we might walk up. around with it. That's like, a fact. I definitely want to know how I feel. Like, I want to like, know how I feel to go inside like, pussy. You basically on the fact that you oh. give birth. Yes. It's the best thing in the world. Look, look. I heard his If Misfit was here, she could probably tell you what that. But anyway. Oh, my for us, Shout out to Misfit. Yeah, that, Misfit. But that's, yeah, that's the sis. But mm-hmm. that's like your role. That's that's a beautiful not thing about women. That's not my role. Remy, you get, sorry, the, you get that you're not, you. you're not like, you, you're not, you really can't speak for the masses when it comes to it. You get that you think very differently than the yeah, average yeah, woman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're more like me. I, I, I didn't say it but should be two children. Babies, if you're that's saying that like that. I, I, I have two children. All right, so why is that not, not your role. role? That's not my job. That's not my job. To Whose have job babies. is it? Really? It's not my job to Whose have job babies. Is it? What's it's your job then? Do, do you believe that's my part job, of your job? I have some jobs I'm an I'm a entertainer. I don't believe that's part yeah, of my job. I'm, I'm not saying that's something not you get paid job. for. In a relationship, but it's something that you it's have not that we can't job have. To have to have babies because there's some men that can't produce. They can't give me a baby. So does yeah. so yeah. that mean he's like jobless? Bliss? You're unemployed? Yeah. Like yeah. And that's why that hurts. So no, because that's why they invented like IVF and things like that. So so a woman that so a woman that can't have children is useless. Right. I'm not saying she's useless. Why 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 would you say useless? Because she said that's her role. That's her job. But but we were we were talking about the differences in in men and women. I'm saying there's things that you can experience that I can experience. And right? you think everything Correct. that you can experience, I can. No, I'm asking you. There's things that you can experience that I can experience. True. Yes. All right. The same way this is also right. So I can. Yeah. right, and instinctively, there's things within me that you probably don't feel, because we're not the one same. One of them is not. One of them is not only wanting to be with one person, but like I, the, I don't. Say I don't, one more time for for math. Uh, again, again, two things. One, <laughs> no, one size is not fit all. Mm-hmm. And number two, I think the main reason you're running into this roadblock, this mm-hmm. buzzsaw, is because Remy doesn't think like the, the, average, the, other the other regular women. woman. Yeah, I agree. And you keep you're you're trying you're trying no, to. I'm, I'm not trying to explain. I'm just trying to say she's a very we're, bad we're spokesperson not. for women in general. <laughs> yeah. She's a terrible spokesperson. No, she's not. I no, can see. Not. No, 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 being mad as fuck at some of the shit coming out of her mouth right now. I've been called. The, I've been told before. All male chauvinists are. Male. I rest I've my case. That. I've been told that before, but the problem is, I'm a realist. It does. And, I'm not saying you're of, wrong or right. And a lot of people, some women, like to live in a fantasy world yeah. where everything mm. fits into a box, mm-hmm. and the box is checked, and this is your role, mm-hmm. and this is that. And when shit don't go that way, that's why they home oh, crying, mm-hmm. ready to sign themselves to slit your wrist records. Yeah. Hold on, hold like, on. What? Scooby Doo? Because that sounds like what? you're explaining exactly what I'm saying. No, that, that, it's that not. Sound like that's that. what I, yeah. no, that sounds like no. she's explaining he, you're, exactly you're what I'm talking about. You're trying to say that men, we think like this, and we, but women, y'all think with your hearts. All women don't think like that. No, 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 not even, definitely not all, but. Let me tell you something. I'm a, 
don't kill me, ladies, please. I, I just have to The fact that you even have to really, say that before really you get what you're about to Sometimes say. Sometimes we go along with some of the shit that we know y'all think about us because it just makes life easier. easier. Oh, yeah. this nigga think that I'm going to think that. Yeah, and yeah. That, that's, that's not a... That's but not we're a, smarter than you guys. We are. So it really doesn't matter. No, I you're not, you're not, you're not crazy, smarter right? than us. We are. You just scheme, you that just scheme no longer fact. than us. That listen, is, listen, that is not listen. Fact. All right, you ever, you, ever, you ever had like somebody on the block that was weaker than you but talked too much shit and you would like, I really bully him, but like, you can get the best of them. Yeah, everybody does so that. So right? once that person realized, no, yo, I can't fight you physically, they start doing little sneaky shit and mm -hmm. talking to this person, making up rumors about you and all that. That's Scheming. women. No, Y'all scheme women. longer than us, but no, you're not From smarter birth. than us. From birth, women. I hear you. Girls uh -huh. are more mature. Their frontal lobe developed earlier. Than, than men. Right. You know what? Right. No, okay, let me play I this understand out. that. But so, does it mean that you're smarter than that? That no, no, means no, no. you mature faster. Because once my shit develop, it's over for you. I want to know what it's over for you. I'm going to buy my shit already. Yeah. 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 I, I want to go with that. Let's, time nah, because you got used to thinking you got used to thinking you were smarter. And now all of a sudden you're like, oh shit, niggas is smarter. So when a girl is with a bum dude and is always messing with trash dudes and keeps saying men are trash and I don't understand how he finessed me, that's bullshit. Because if you're going to say you're smarter than us, you knew what you was getting into. Yeah, most, most, most women right? know what they know go, when they're going being finessed. Yeah. That's men mm -hmm. or women. The same way when men, mm -hmm. you be like, mm -hmm. yo, this nigga's a trick. He's doing this. He's that. Like, he know he's being finessed. But mm -hmm. as human beings, nobody wants to be hurt. Of course So not. we create these, these false... Narratives and I these have. false no, these, not even narratives. It's this false environment mm. that makes us feel more comfortable with what we, 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 we doing. She really loves me. She fucking other niggas, but I know she really loves me. Like, <laughs> mm. nigga, you know she really don't. You know it's because you got the bag, but it makes you feel, feel better, better and you can deal with it better. Mm. The same way sometimes with women, they know like, all right, yeah, I know he be doing me wrong. He doing this, but the feeling that she gets when he's, he's there. not doing that mm -hmm. trumps the feeling that she feels when, when she's she, fucked is doing up. Mm -hmm. So they tolerate certain shit. There may come a time when they don't tolerate it no more and there may be times where this is just how the cycle goes because people, as human beings, we just want to feel good. Or maybe they yeah. like what's happening. Maybe mm -hmm. what's happening you know? actually makes them feel good. But, but oh. understand that there's always going to be a line that makes us different. If I'm standing on the corner, we are and, different. But we're and very, Kay walk up to me and slap the shit out of me, than people think. Niggas is going to be watching to see if I'm a hitter or I'm gonna do anything or you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. And if I do that, oh, this nigga wilding. But the other way around, it's well, okay. they want it from the rip. Mm -hmm. There's a difference. There's always going to be a but difference that, but between that has men and women. Nothing to do with men and women. That has to do with the way society. society. No, it has to do with men and women because physically we're just no, we're, we're, we're built not. different. I know we're like, built to protect you. That's not you. true. There's some things that I will slap across the fucking street because we're built different. You just a you know, little know nigga. You like, said, what know what you, you said? Know what you said? Yesterday, like, you said men are the new what? Bitches. Remember, that was one of the questions I had. You know where that comes from? Where that come from? This thinking that we're the same. That's where it comes from. Mm. It comes from not supporting, all right, you're a man. This is your role. This is what you do. It comes from, oh, do whatever you want to do. Do you want to be a girl? Do you want to be a boy? Do you want to? No. No, I think it comes That's where from. That comes so from. you telling no. me, mm -hmm. using the same example that you have, right? You standing on the block, girl comes, smacks the shit out of you. You feel differently than when I'm standing there on the block with my girls and you come and smack the shit out of me. Neither one of us want to get the shit smacked out of us in front of, like, in yeah, fucking front but, of anybody. But I'm just saying, period. generally. So what, what plays into that whole whether who does the smacking is society's per perception of what just happened. When a woman does it because it's a woman and there's all these perceptions that women are weaker than men and all these, these other situations, it's not taken as, oh, she really violated. It's like, oh, she violated, but whatever. Now, if you do, it's like, oh, he's out of pocket. He's totally exactly. out of pocket. And that's all society-based things because there's some countries, not here, yeah. Yeah. where 
you will get no. stoned. Women women will be stoned to yeah. death. No, no, I, and yeah, people that's come a in fact. And add more that's rocks a fact. To it, like, <laughs> yeah. That's a fact. Stone but, her. But I beg to differ. And it because, won't. No, and it I won't. I beg to be differ because I guarantee you, if I was to sit here and play a video of women smacking the shit out of men and men smacking the shit out of women, one of them is just gonna look more violent than the other it one. It depends where you're playing the video. Because like I told you, there are countries where women do That's certain true. things and you will literally stone her to death. They will be throwing rocks and other women will be throwing stones too until right. she's dead. Because it was because there's a position in that this society. Is the way their society is. So I think here in this country, we've been programmed. Oh, sorry. We've been programmed. Thank you. We've been programmed to think like this whole damsel in distress and protect the woman. And that has nothing to do mm -hmm. with us as black people, because that that that's that's not of us. That's how a lot of us. And our ancestors lost their lives because it's the, they're after our women, protect the women. So there's, that, there's a lot of that still trickling down to where women have to be protected and women are so dainty. And, this, and that's really not the case because, like you said, one of the main things that we do that y'all can't do is the, one of the hardest fucking things that baby. I've ever had to do in my life. Have a baby. And it's not even, ha it's, it's just the whole process of it. Mm -hmm. You have right. to be strong. Like it's if if people knew the statistics of women that died in childbirth, Birth, yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. Like especially black women, they would they Word. would know how strong you really have to be. But do you know how mentally strong that. a man has to be to deal with a pregnant? <laughs> You know what? Yeah. Yeah, that's Yo, it. son, you don't understand, bro. No. I understand. All women are really really pregnant, though. Whoa. But I, I mean, it's, it, it is a rugged thing. But Zero I mean, to 60, watching bro. Watching that stomach getting big and having to lay on the side. No, it's, and, and, it's, and it's a beautiful thing. It's crazy. And, and this is what I'm saying. Like, that's crazy. No. Like, Imagine a fucking hole on your body this big being stretched this fucking big. What are you talking Jesus. about? That's crazy. Ripped. No, the whole the But whole it's process. natural. The whole process. So it's not crazy. No. It's like saying, oh, it, oh, it's raining outside. That's crazy. No, it's natural. <laughs> so because it's, Shit is natural. So, so it rains here. So because it's natural, that means it's not crazy? No, it's not crazy. Bro, it's, I, I think the more, that, the more that we call things crazy. Row, that's not crazy? Yo, no, 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 that's not. That's not. Are you in the room when your kids was born? Yes. And so you saw them so you saw them come out and the purple shit and all, all that, that shit. All that when I when I crazy saw that stuff. In, in my eyes, I said my baby mom's is a beast for doing this shit. Seeing her take and, the knees and, and, and this is what I'm saying. That. Like, that was the next as level women, for me. No, that's you guys, new. you guys are like epidural, some new shit. Epidural, yeah. Let's flash no, back a couple you guys years are like, back before that. You guys are like gods like on earth, mm. and that's why you're held to a higher standard. Mm -hmm. That's why I could go around this block and smash all the chicks on the block. But you can't because people will look at you a certain way. She can't. Because you're held you. to a higher standard. You're the mother. The you're the ones that the teach same. us, He's yo, right. don't go out there killing everybody. Don't load up a machine gun and go through a school killing mm -hmm. little kids. Like, that's who you are. We hold you to a higher standard. Fathers but the more that y'all try to be like, oh, we're the same. No, we're not the same. There's that but is that, is that, that the there. premise of your new rap battle? Because now you got men versus the women, women, right? Yeah. Absolutely. So are you and all the women are going to lose. Huh? So are you oh, trying to Jesus show? Jesus Christ. Oh, all of them. Yo, she's ready to. Jesus oh, Christ. Wow. Remy, Remy, Remy. My question oh, is you. Wow. Remy. Oh. Women been oh, smoking really men in battles for years. Really, Jesus my question Christ. to you is... Yes. Look, yes. my question to you is because you said at first that it's an all-female rap league. So you uh, so you adding the men now to show that the women are just as good? Absolutely. Yeah, better. And better. <laughs> <laughs> but, but why? <laughs> uh, I'm so quiet. You don't believe that <laughs> shit. I know you don't believe <laughs> Man. I'm so You scared. don't rap better than me. Get up. You get up. What? You don't rap better. Get in your bag, Rim. You lying. You don't rap better. You're lying. I, I, on God, I feel like that. My, in my nigga, heart in here. I got to be. Since since women think with their heart and her for heart. For me to kill you on. Whenever you ready. Whenever you ready. You know what would be a great? Swear to God, whenever you ready. You wait, 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 wait. Whenever don't say ready. anything yet. Let this go. Yeah, let this go. Let this go. Never. Ever. Listen to me. It's never, ever. Happens because you're not gonna rap no, on it. In my entire <laughs> career, that's why. In my entire career, from songs that I've done with the pun to my husband Papoose to Jay Z 
to Fat Joe. Oh, I'm going to be the first? To Nas. Oh, shit. All of the That's Busta crazy. Rhymes. And movie, it's never happened from when I was a kid to now. It's never in the history of my career <laughs> happened. Oh, that nigga gonna walk kills me. All right. It's she never happened. Right. Yo, can, can, can't happened. wait. I can't, hold on, hold on. Can I we can't. see a battle between Matthew and Remy? No, no I want to hear a track. No, no, no. I'm not going to put money behind that. Put the battle on Remy? No, I missed it. Let's do a one-rounder five minutes. That would be ill. Math versus Remy. I want to hit a record. Right you, you, I want to hit a record. Fuck the I'm record. I'm going to tell you my reasoning, right? So mm-hmm. let's just, first we got to do oh. my promo. Yeah. Saturday. Uh-huh. June 11th. June 11th. June 11th. Chrome 23. You're doing two dates, right? Ladies and gentlemen. The day before, on Friday, June 10th, I have a one-shot card. Okay. Where it's a bunch of girls that's coming in and they all doing one-rounders. Mm. So that they can, like, because there's so, there's so many women that's that's been in it and they, when we're doing battles, we only pick from a certain amount gotcha. because what people understand, this is a business and you have mm-hmm. to put people in the card that's going to make people buy tickets. Mm-hmm. Right. There's so many people that are talented and I want to be give them a, a, a chance Mm. To Fire. show that, you know, maybe Fire. we could put them on the next on a, card. On a big card. Yeah. But I have the ladies and gentlemen card. And the reason why I did this, even though it's an all-female battle rap league, is because I feel like as women, we are always giving our flowers as women. Even when we're even when we're um even when we're battling other women. It's She's good as a woman. Right. So, me personally, I feel like I never really got my just due until you can prove that you're just as good as that next to a man. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's in any field, not just rap. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah mm-hmm. that's right. In any, any um, occupation, we always have our gender, but before a female, Female lawyer. They choose a man. Female, you know, whatever. It's just, you just, you could be, there will be like a female cab driver, mm-hmm. female bus driver. Like, your, your gender's always placed there. Like, I've never heard a guy, it's like, how does it feel, you know, being a male rapper? No one asks At anybody. Like, they, they actual time, you know, being a female rapper. How does so, it feel being a male nurse? There you go. Yeah. And it's, it's a lot of less female rappers than men, especially back then. So that's probably why, because you but, was in a no, male dominated arena. I'm just talking about any field, though. Mm-hmm. Any field, female cops, I, I think female it's based on majority, though. female basketball players. Like, you're always going to be held that's, here that's compared to I mean, men. Sports is different because sports we're built different It's physical. It's physical. Right? It's, yeah. It's a lot it more physical. It depends what the sport is. Yeah, it true. It depends what the sport is. It's a lot more is. physical. It depends what the sport is. But I say all of that to say I want and I don't think all the women are going to lose. It depends. on who, Who's on the card? So I have... I'll predict this whole um, shit right now. I have... Well, you want to hear my original card before I had to switch it around? No, because other <laughs> leagues are going to hear your original card. No, well, there's nothing they can do about it. I don't really care. It's, okay, it's like cool. My original card was supposed to be... Um, it was supposed to be Prestavia versus J2. What? Yeah. It's Prestavia and J2. Female battle. But go ahead. It is not a female it battle. It is a female Stop battle. It. No, it's not. All right. He's very much a man. He's, he's starting in trouble already. I hear you. Nah, he's, he's starting in trouble yeah. already. Look it up, bro. Like, <laughs> no, I'm just, your sexual preference does not change your gender. All right. Uh, you have to physically oh, do that okay. in this day and age. I get, I but, get you. Um, the second one is official versus Av. Mm. Yeah, Av's taking that. What? Av is taking that. It's official versus Av. Um, Gaddis versus Rum Nitty. Mm. Yeah, Rum Nitty. <laughs> Let's um, go. And it was supposed to be Vixen versus Twerk, and Miss Hustle versus Tay Rock. Hustle was taking mm. that. Uh, twerk. Uh, he don't. That's the he original don't stay card. Focus. He yeah, that's the original question. He, he choked too much. Card. I can see now, Vixen taking that. If you that put him up against Chokers. But yeah, they're gonna do what's the card now? Out. I'm pre- a prepared twerk is not is a prepared not. Ch- twerk is dangerous. It's, it's, yeah, but yeah. it's mm-hmm. the the gamble is always is he gonna no, be prepared? It's hit and miss he was with that. Absolutely prepared. Remember, I play, I put this card together with my other card in February, right? Early March. So people's had two months plus. The card you was trying to get me on. 
the card that I was trying to get you on, but we're not going to talk about that. Oh, we're not? Really? Because I'm like, yeah, we're not going to. You want to talk about cool. it? Because yeah, I really no. feel the fucking way about it. So why? Oh, why do you feel the way? Because yeah. when I fucking ask somebody to do something, they just fucking do it. They don't, you was giving me a hard time. I just shouldn't, I shouldn't even be here. I really came here to fight you. <laughs> you really came here to fight I really came here to fight you. I'm not going to fight you, man. Who did you I want him to battle? You. No, no, take, no, 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 no. I should take no. advantage of that woman privilege, right? Just smack the shit out of her. You see that? Why see, that, like, see oh. that'll be some shit. That's, that's what women do. That'll be some we shit. We do that, though. Yeah. Why, though? Because. Really? Because you piss me off and I want to fucking smack you. And I know I can't beat you, but I'm a fucking... See, see, the, see the great thing about me is me back. I, I've learned to ignore women. <laughs> 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 I've learned to ignore I'm not going to lie. I don't, I don't hit niggas because I always think and I'll be if prepared, I was a no. nigga, I'm going to knock yeah. this bitch out. When shit, I swing so on a nigga, I'll be prepared for the man back. I don't hit... I don't hit. I just, I just, I just, I just, I just not swinging, hold though. Hold on, hold on. How does, I just not swing. Why, why just try not swinging? Why not just keep your hands to yourself some and avoid niggas, all of these? Some niggas know how to push them buttons. If, if, if you think I know what I came from, man. Buttons? I know what I came from. It's well, okay, man. It's okay, man. It's okay. Wait, wait, wait. She's not here. She's not here. I'm so scared. 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 I'm so let me just let me just put this out. Let's put this out. I've never been hit by a woman. I've never had a, I've never had a woman. So what you got the machine in order for? Oh, because she, she was rat. systematically trying to burn my life down. Systematically, and she was calling the cops and pointing the finger. And when the cops show up at your door, first thing in their head is you did it. Yes. Yeah, and when they moment. start when they uh. started giving her cues on shit to say about me while I'm standing there as if, like, I'm like, what the fuck Because you're probably trying to hit. Oh, no, I get a restraining, oh, probably the captain, but I get a restraining order to say, hey, it's documented that on this day, I asked this woman to stay the fuck away from me, permanently. Mm -hmm. And otherwise, I got nothing written down, it turns into her word versus mine, and because I'm a man, I live under the assumption of guilt, mm -hmm. which means when they show up, the first words out of their mouth is, what did you do? Right. Black man. And I have to Black answer man. that question. And, I'm and if still I don't Jackie, answer it you right, did something. I want you to know that. Oh, <laughs> no. I, I, no. oh, I 100% did something that she feels warranted everything that came down the pipe. I don't question that shit. Of course she thinks I deserve what she was doing. Did I? No. No, telling her to go the fuck away from me and, and, and this is over because I don't want you blowing up my line. I don't want you insulting my aunt when she calls because it's a woman's voice. Like, shit but you, like that. But you violated, man, because you was, about you was that the 50th nigga to tell her that. See how can fast I, that happened? Hold on. About that no, 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 stop. Did you, did you no, hear what she said? Can I ask this question right here? Don't and that's the difference. Didn't care. She was and that's the difference. You know, let me ask. We don't do it with this. We don't do it with this. Y'all both say we don't do it with this. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> we don't do it with this. And we, if we cut it, nah, we do it with this. Yeah. Yeah. All the other stuff, that wasn't with this. I actually uh, deaded her off it. I actually deaded her off of sex a while before that happened. Almost oh, like your savage. homegirl is talking. You're I told a her, savage. I told her, no, so, and I, I'm about to get super personal. When my father passed, and I looked over at him and was like, what the fuck am I still doing here? Like, why am I putting up with this? Why do I feel like this is what I deserve from anybody? I'm a good dude. I'm trying to do the right thing out here. And this is what I'm getting. Shorty, get away from me. And that was all she wrote. And after that, her not having that level Man. of control, snap. Because as a pretty woman, she's not used to anybody telling her no. Most women, especially <laughs> gorgeous ones, <laughs> are not equipped to you hear no. You know what she no. said a couple seconds ago? Pretty Back girl privilege. Because then you just supposed to do what I say. Uh-huh. <laughs> you didn't open up the door, so I'm coming in and violating you because you told me no. <laughs> what so, you gonna say, huh? Yo. I'm not denying it, so I don't like to be told no. Fellas, you deserve better. Don't stay I in those situations. Fellas, fellas, do you want? Nah. <laughs> she said, she I'm said something crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Woo. She said something about swinging, right? Real, real, no, no, hold on, hold on. If a woman swings on a dude, should that relationship automatically be done? 
If I was or, a guy, absolutely, this relationship is over. Don't put There's no giving her a chance or nothing, You're right? You're going to get me locked up because I'm going to break your Because, you know, guys... I'm just talking on, as if I was On the first the swing, a guy would be like, uh... If, no, what guys you know? I'm there are guys that like that. On the first swing, he's getting a restraining order. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> no, the first swing, the first thing I needed... <laughs> there are guys that like that, huh? I'm going to document the action right here. Remember? There you go. Remember what, what, you said, relationship. Remember what you said it's, about reflex? That's why I get nah, a restraining Yeah, but an abusive relationship is not just a one-time thing. It's over time. But, but so, do you remember what I said earlier? Yeah. I, don't even yell at me. Like, there's, there's, there's mm-hmm. levels to it. Like, mm-hmm. I, don't, I don't want to. You have to have your boundaries. So mm-hmm. I feel like anybody who I've ever saw get swung on once, there's usually another swing on twice. Mm-hmm. Look, I, agree. Is, I, I got I gotta say this. Second one connect. Like I gotta relationship say this for, done, for, right? for all of us. For all of us. A lot of us are coming from environments where we've seen a lot of trauma. We've seen a oh, lot of we things. Traumatized. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We 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 wake up during the day and we go on Instagram, we see people that look just like us being killed and treated like they're less than mm. than than humans. It takes a lot for all of us to reach a point in our minds, a a level of consciousness where you decide this is not what we deserve. Agree. So for the people out there who haven't figured it out yet, don't hold that guilt against yourself. You can be better and you do deserve better. And for the people that's going through it, if that's what's going on, step away from that shit. Word. Get the, get as far as you can get away from a that a fucking shit. restraining order. <laughs> <laughs> she not getting over that. That's not at all. No, but, but, but for guys, it's like, yo, women women do that shit like, what you said? Oh, you yelled too? All right, nigga. Restraining yeah, order. Yeah, I don't need a restraining order. But for guys, it's like... I never got a restraining yeah, order. You're like, you like, yo, you be standing right. outside the I'm precinct like, damn, I feel like a bitch-ass nigga. Yeah, I'm calling my yeah. brother. Oh, what are you doing? My brothers, my uncles. You want to yell at me? Hold on one second. If I called... Stay if right called, If I called the women... Keep that same Energy if I call the women for shit like that, it's going. Yo, that was me. My I, brothers. I'm. Hold on. I, hold my on. brother will tell a chick, "I'll go get my sister right now. Yeah, play I'm with me." That's a fact. They knew. I'm a brother. When I come, it's up to you. That's it. So go ahead, play my brother if you want to. I got. Mm. I got, like, that's I got three sad. sisters. I tell I'm anybody the, I'm, I'm dating, I'm like, yo, don't argue with no man. Word. Don't say nothing Word. crazy. Word. Just Word. come get me. If you can't do that. Walk the fuck Walk away. away. Cause if that nigga put his hands on you and it's I can't find him later, it's, but, we both gonna but be sitting a here mad. to that because you have to know who the woman is. Because I've seen women. Let's use talk about it. Men mm. as well. Like when I call them, it's it's for a real reason. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I've seen so many people literally die. They ain't got their baby fathers killed. They ain't got their brothers killed. They ain't got their uncles killed. Calling them because yeah. they know yeah. that they, they got the family member that'll go. Yeah. And there's always that one cousin, that one sister that, oh, I'm calling my brother, I'm calling it to be over some right. bullshit that so, they done so, did. Yeah, that's true. You have so to know the women. Let's just know. Be clear, guys. Just, just this week, I moved into a new building. There's an NFL player's girlfriend who was at the pool. You know, my daughter's well, my, my oldest daughter, she's rough. She's used to playing with her brothers. So she was a little rough with her daughter and like pushed her under the water. It scared the shit out of me, so I know it scared the shit out of her. But her reaction and the way she, she was yelling at my daughter. Now tell her what you did. When you jumped in, you jumped in the water. Yeah, I, yeah, I pulled her out. And he I pulled the girl to, out. And she was like, you better check her. Yo, look at her. And she's pointing at my daughter. My daughter's sensitive. Like, she knows she did something wrong. She could tell from my reaction, like, Oh, what did I do? What did I do? She doesn't know. She's a little kid. Mm-hmm. Even the, her daughter still wanted to play with my daughters. Right. But she's spazzing and saying all Doing this stuff. I'm most. like, yo, you don't talk to kids like that. She mm-hmm. said, you know what? How about I go get my go get her father and y'all can sort it out. And I'm like, go get that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> but it's stupid. Like, why would you, why would you right. even present that? You know what I'm saying? Right. It's what it is. And now I, this is happening. Did he come? No. Actually, nah. I ain't gonna say <laughs> that. I ain't gonna go in pussy. Because at the same time, he might know the woman that he's dealing with. He knows with. he's dealing yeah. with. What yeah. you did. Exactly. What you did. But I'm joking, by the way. They don't believe you're joking. <laughs>
Not That's at why all. I can't joke. Like I'm one of those people. Like if I say something, like I don't even play with people. Like y'all, like when I catch you, I'm just like I can't even play like that because mm-hmm. people believe that it's gonna happen. Right. I see people say it all the time, and I, I laugh at them. Like she sounds so cute and fake gangsta. Like me, I say stuff and people take me serious. I be banned from places. I can't go and like no, no, so, no Miss Remy. Uh, uh, we we saw the the Matt yeah. Hoffa interview and. Uh, you know, it's we're kind of nervous. Tonight, right? <laughs> 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 I said I was kidding. Hey, yo, this is awesome. So I said I was joking, that's, that's but um, I, I, definitely, I definitely feel like women and men, I'm going to say it again, I feel like we're very, we're way more, I don't want to say we're the same, because I, I think that's where you lose it. I'm, I'm wording it wrong. Mm-hmm. We're way more similar. Than yeah. people people like think to give us credit it. for it, right. right? And the things that make us different is the way we react to things. Like I, it's, it still amazes me how guys can control their tears. Yeah. That shit is the craziest shit to me. Like I've watched men, like people that I know, they love their mothers die, and they're just like in the funeral, not one. Like you, how you think that that's control? No. What is that, it? What did you shut off your fingers? That, How did this that, work? Like that is me. us. Because when I get tight, I cry, and now I'm crying, and now somebody got to get beat up. Yeah. So teach me. How do you control that? Like how? When you watch the yeah. Rock Wilder interview, you'll understand. Like it's tough for yeah. us. Like it was you're, an emotional you're told moment. You can't be like that. Yeah, we're not allowed to be like don't. that. Yeah. Me, don't. I'm not that chick. I'm not the one that's gonna be like but this. I, okay. But I'm not. I'm, not a, me, I'm gonna bring it up later on in the fight. I'm not gonna bring nothing right there. I'm gonna be like this. Later <laughs> on, that allows you to be crying ass nigga. And you was crying. Yeah, you're not crying. Yeah, absolutely. That's, that's, why, that's, we that's, that's, that's why, why we don't. That's why we don't do it. it. True. Right. I didn't say why. Yeah. I just wanna know how. Because I told y'all that female shit. Tell me something. Because we know. No, no, no. No, no. I'm not asking why y'all don't like it. I'm telling her how. I don't want to be in the group chow. This right. nigga cried. Look, to, to quote Gotti, to quote, yeah. to quote thing, this though. guy Smith. in these streets, all you got yeah, is just facts, your smiles and your cries. Yeah. You got to control those, because if you don't, Shit, people hard. will know how to control you. And it's embarrassment. When you weaponize it, it it's a fucking yeah. weakness. Wow. When you turn it into an That's insult. It's like if I put an onion right here, there's nothing you can do about it. Yeah. If something is emotionally attached to me, I literally, I've tried to do it before. It's like, you ever had to get like, I don't know, any type of surgery or anything, and you try to fight the anesthesia, you yeah. like count to 10, and, and it'd be, be like, over. you can't do it. Like, I'm that person. Like, I've almost made it. I made this like six one time. I was like, oh, I nah, I did too. Like, I, I be trying to beat it. <laughs> what number you I, made it up to, K? That's some weird Bro, shit. Bro, I don't remember what number I made yeah. it up to, but my eyes is open for a minute. Like, yeah. so, so, so you like in, in shut moment, your feelings off. No, it depends, like, like, um, Rest in peace, black. Do y'all let my it man, out after? Like my man got killed yeah, right in front of me. By yourself? Yeah, I had to yeah. keep everything mm-hmm. together for everybody. Mm-hmm. From his mother to, to, to everybody was there, to his brother and all that. At the end of the night, when I walked out of there, I, I collapsed and I started crying. But that's because you but were so busy moment, pro- uh, handling so much, you couldn't process your feelings. And once you was able to process well, it. It, it may mm-hmm. not come out, it may not even come out in tears. That, might come that, out it might come yeah. out some some other some way. Frustration. Yeah, there's a lot of different ways that happens. Going, you want to hear something that I'm, I'm I'm sure a lot of women don't know. Most men don't I trust mean. women with their truth. Absolutely Most not. of us do not yeah, because that's facts. the ability, your ability to weaponize our truth and judge us with it. Just when I thought his name was on Tommy Son, I did. Yeah, no tennis racket. I thought it was a boss. <laughs> you think like a fucking guy. What do you expect? <laughs> like, stop thinking you're gonna be surprised not over here. Like you're, with, you're with your own. Right. <laughs> 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 you in the barbershop, you belong here, like, no, but, stop it. But honestly, I think once we start to celebrate the differences between men and women again, you're going to see a lot more sisterhood, you're going to see a lot more brotherhood, mm-hmm. a lot more love for, for, for each other because we'll respect our roles that we have to play for each other. When you have these lines constantly crossing, then... You know, you got a whole bunch of bitch ass niggas outside, and you got so a whole I, bunch of women me, that, that you know, I could me, go on a shootout with her. You like, told uh. me my role is to have children. What is what is your role? What is men's role? To protect, protect the children. Mm-hmm. To protect you. Damn, protect, what about protect? Protect, because look, Just I mean, it comes in the package. If we die, well, we're not all gonna die. 
But like if if all the men are wiped out except for one, we still have hope. Yeah. But if all the women are wiped out except for one, uh, you up. have no hope. It's over. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We no hope. It's over you. You know it's what I'm saying? Over. So it's always been the role for us to protect y'all. Not really. That's just really? the fact. That's not the fact. We we're gonna reproduce out. and y'all can. We'll die out. That, that's yeah. all. Yeah, we'll be all, y'all we'll all die. But if you got yeah. one woman left, you're not dying out. Bastard. You know what? The, you that's know what that the baby's gonna look like two generations. But what's gonna happen to everybody else? We're gonna die out. No. No, if there's only one man, you're saying like I, the one guy, he's just gonna go and impregnate. What if you have yes. a boy? What if that one woman has a boy? It's over. It's over. She you do know again. she can get pregnant again, right? <laughs> she can go again. Yeah. What if she keeps having boys? It's over. <laughs> Sober, that, but that's what makes you yeah, more. Has 10 that's girls what makes in a women row. more important. What if you keep giving boys? What if every one? Then we're, then we're then done. Out. Out. Exactly. Stop yeah. trying to make it seem like y'all are saving the earth. No, nah, but, but <laughs> you, <laughs> get it. you get it though. I get it. You get it. I, 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 I can't explain it to you. Let me you just get it. it. Let me you just went fight against you. This all. Remy's a Jeopardy champion, so she know. I tried to challenge you on Jeopardy. I am. Don't fuck with me on Jeopardy. Yo, Jeopardy. Yo, she ill with it. Yeah. We had did an interview years ago. And, uh, well, you know, women are smarter than men. Yeah. When <laughs> this dude yeah, got a restraining order, women are smarter than men. Right. Man. He yeah. going all the way to the game. You got a restraining order off uh, intelligence, right? Bro, I know, shit, to, right? I know, I know, to, I know to keep my so, hands. So, so what did we learn today? I know to keep my hands to myself. That there are no female pimps. Yes, there are. There is one. I was raised that by female pimps. That's what I wanted to say. There's a girl in Pimping men. Hold on. Is she pimping men? She has four husbands. And is she's she in Atlanta and they're killing her online for Is she for pimping them? No, I think she's pimping. No she's paying for everything. Is she no pimping them? If she's paying for everything, she's a no, pimp. Okay. Say that again. That's, he said, Who buying dick? No, yeah. Who's buying dick? Can you ever dick? bought dick? No. no. Would you, like, would you buy dick? dick? Whatever. Why would I buy dick? dick? It's the best wow. dicks in the world. Bitches pull up in the car and be like, oh, nah, have a ten dollars. Come on, have a fuck out of here. No one's right. That's a Come bad here. purchase. Yo, That's yo, leave, leave in the comments to see what happens. Come here. Yeah, yeah, if, 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 if I, if I, if you know a nigga that would be like, you're shorty. If I told you, if I told you, why not? Why not? I'm not buying. I got enough toys. I'm not buying no dick. I don't need to buy dick. You took care of a nigga for four years. That was it. Buy dick. That was that was buying dick. That was buying dick. She didn't just say that. That was buying dick. Yes, it really was. What you no, saying, dude? Nigga, really did. You were buying dick. No, no, no. Yes. It was no, really no, 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 I let him go. Yeah, okay. Finance or you know the deal. Yeah, okay. Buy it. Yeah, you it you got to buy it for more. <laughs> that's the problem. You was buying it. <laughs> <man. laughs> you just mad. Yeah, yeah. Well, you got to buy it. Listen, listen. That, 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 that's, so, that's another difference so that's why between no us. Pimps. What was that? No, I'm just saying that, that's, a, that's why there's a difference between us. No Because you're not going to find good dick everywhere, but if a man knows what he's doing, then he could work with pretty much anything. True. Very true. Y'all agree with that? Yeah, what do you mean? You saying every girl got good pussy? <laughs> that sounds like I don't want to. Is that what you're saying? If you know how to work it? Yes. I've been around some whack pussy. I've been around some whack pussy. Hold on. What, it's rare. Wait, what can't makes it whack? She what can't makes it whack? She can't yeah. take no dick. It be lot of, it be shit that makes you can't ride no dick But that's not good. against, that's not against the, 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 the pussy. It's against her. Well, she owns she the pussy. Say, she owns the pussy. She has the pussy. All right. But it's it's not, dude got but whack. That don't make it whack. It, it, it was whack. That means you, know, you got to get her into bondage <laughs> so she can't run. That's what that means. Tie her up. Really she can't run. I'm oh, just it's to good. Give Nigga said it's not the pussy. Like, what are you just saying? I'm just saying. That's crazy. I'm just saying. You know what? I learned a lot today. Yeah. Because Remy, because Remy came in here way different than I thought she was. Because usually, when you say men versus women, people usually try to challenge each other. Yeah. yeah. And I feel like when you're doing the relationship shows, we can learn a lot mm. from women because that's a fact. If they're willing to tell us how they really think, 
that's dope. But that's I realize golden. doing relationship shows that men don't like hearing the truth yeah. mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and knowing what they really think. Right. And then when you're trying to tell women what we really think, they'll turn around and be like, no, that's not it. Right. How are you going to tell me that? I'm right. a man. So these type of forums where we can well, it's share already been, knowledge. You know, established that I think like a man, so I'm not a good... It's just- Teach the other women. I'm not a good source. No, 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 For seven of the years that I was married, the pussy was locked away. Mm -hmm. Couldn't even get to it where you want to. Mm -hmm. Talk about it. All right? I love boxing. I love basketball. I love football. I can fight. I don't fight for no reason. I can fight. Know my way around. A few weapons here and there. I know how to get money. I can hold an intelligent conversation. I can be real ignorant. Mm. My husband... He's a real Brooklyn nigga. Like, he's not a lame. He's not a cornball. He's a real, through and through to the heart Brooklyn nigga. He fuck with me. Because I'm the realest ever. Like, I'm fire. Like, if chicks was more like me, the world would be a better place. You're not going to have the insecurities. You're not going to have the, like... Do you know what the average chick would do knowing that she's in jail for seven years and her husband is out here? They're going to drive themselves crazy. Mm. I'm not doing that. If he's going to do whatever he's going to do, he's going to do that. And that's just nothing on the planet. All the pussy in the world is not going to stop a nigga from getting other pussy. It's just not going to happen. And I know that and I understand that. All the money in the world is not going to stop it. You could be the baddest, cutest, flyest bitch with the best. None of that shit matters. You have to know what your nigga like, who he is, and what he's on. The same way Matt just said, it's certain boxes that's just gonna be in my box. If you're not okay with that box, that should probably that probably shouldn't be your nigga. Right. Mm-hmm. Period. And I think the problem with a lot of women in a lot of relationships is that women we have these like she said we think about our weddings since we make these stupid games. My dress is gonna be pink, and I'm gonna have eight bridesmaids. By the time you get of age, you got two friends. Yeah. <laughs> you don't even like people. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He has to be tall. He has to be this. Like, right. We have all of these things that we want, and we literally live like that. And when I say we, I'm talking about women. And, and, and it's not everybody. Everybody's not the same. Like you said, there are different people. But unfortunately, we do these things called statistics. And statistically, mm-hmm. I feel that that's the issue. And it's not that women think with their heart and their emotional. It has nothing to do with any of that. It goes to be with, we're nurtured. We're naturally bred to be caring. Right. Like, that is our role. If women were awesome, I don't give a fuck, fuck that. Like, like he talks all day. Mm. How would we raise these children that is about to be extinct? They will be murders. Depending on one guy to populate the whole world. We have to be like that. It's, <laughs> it's installed in our DNA right. to be nurturous. So it's not because we're just emotional. That's just what it yeah, is. I just want to clap. Yeah. We waited till the end of the show to agree with everything that I said. Whatever. I, 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 I really enjoyed the I show, though. I'm not sure. That was a good look. I, I love this. this. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, we definitely going to do more of these. Yeah. Now, who is actually on the card? Um, it is... My Bitch Hustle. It's, it's hustle, hustle and Vixen is the headline of the card. Hustle and Vixen. Yes. Hustle taking that. Against each other. Against yeah. each other? Against each other. Taking oh. that. Ebony versus hustle? Ivory. Hustle. Versus Vixen. That's Vixen. gonna be a good... Yeah, that's a good one. Amazing. That's gonna be a good... Mm-hmm. Why nobody put that... Through? Why you ain't tell me it was seafood oh. there last time? I didn't know everything that <laughs> was there last time. Seafood I, I made a list of things that, that I wanted and... You know, I was so pissed. My team, they they do the best that they can. Some people mm. like it, some people don't. <laughs> they did amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. This, girl, this, um, this woman is one of a kind. Right? Yeah. Um, yeah. All right, hustle and vixen. We I'm not calling have, that. And everything else. That's is a the dope same. match. Rob is still battling Gaddis. Rob Gaddis. Gaddis, Prestavia and J2, mm-hmm. and official and Av. 
who was, by the way, has never battled a girl ever in his whole life. Have, yeah. And I know, and I know we over, but what's the pre-card? The pre-card has so many names. I don't, oh, I, I do want to say names. it though. Okay. Give him, give him give him a what's the pre-card? Pre it's she the, has um, something on, on the tent that's on the all one oh, round. Right. The tent, that's what we're talking about. Yeah. Yes. Oh, so that's on called the, the pre-card. Okay. Chrome 23. It's a couple of names and I do, and I do want to say them because I appreciate them. And I'm like one of those people, like, I, I respect people who want to invest in themselves. Like, I'm like, listen, it's not the main card, but this is what I can do. And this is, this is your chance to, to make to, it to, to the main to card. Whatever you say people stop you from doing and you want to show them, here, I'm, I'm going to give it to you. And, and everybody who's on this card was like, yeah, this is what we're doing. So we have... Hold on. Is it at the same spot? It's like a summer no. jam pre-show. It's, it's, it's on. That's what I was from. It's like mm -hmm. it's like the summer stage. That's yeah, exactly. exactly. Right. Which I'm performing on this year. So really, congratulations. Yes. Oh. 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 You know what I'm saying? So, so I, I did the, the, I day, the year that I did the pre-stage, I, I ended up doing the main stage the next year. You did the pre-stage before? I did the pre-stage How before. was it? Like, it was it was dope. It was it was like probably one of the biggest crowds that yeah, I've ever seen. Because that's what my team keeps telling me. They like, every, they like oh, everybody you look up to did that pre-stage before. You it's so it's going to be mad people out so there. So I, I main that's stage next year, y'all. Yeah. That's what's up. Go so for it. We so have um, Coco Cakes. Versus uh, Ellis Fitzgerald. DM Coco Cakes is battling now? Yeah, Miss Pack versus Queen P. Okay, I'm familiar. Hazzy versus Ash Cash. Ash, wow. Ash Cash wow. is back? You got her out of retirement? Ash Cash is so, back. That's so crazy. Quasia you know how Pops is. Versus huh? OG Prano. Pops is Wolf. Nah. Lex Banco versus Hope Trilly. Lex Banco is back too? Banco? Oh, mm -hmm. you brought all of them back. K oh, Profit a... versus K Cash Marissa. K, K Profit. Cheddar versus Charisma. Wow, oh, that's gonna be good. And Jada Ray versus Fendi. Yo, you pulled and Jada Ray. Ray. Wow, Jada Ray. So everybody, that's the one shot card. I think is I I I think both nights is gonna be amazing yeah. in, in in their own rights. So I hope everybody, if you mm -hmm. don't have your tickets, get your tickets now. Get you your tickets now. Ticketmaster.com. They won't rob you. I went through a lot to make sure that I could get my tickets on Ticketmaster. So please utilize the platform. Um, if you can't find it, just type in Remy and it'll pop up. You can mm -hmm. go to the link in my bio. I also have a pay-per-view that I'm doing. Um, you could pre-order the pay-per-view. And yeah. Congratulations. 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 And happy birthday. Thank you. Oh, birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. My birthday was two days ago. Oh, happy two days birthday. Ago. Oh, happy belated. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Oh, yeah, Gemini. That's right. Ah, oh, Gemini was the 16th. That's fine. Yeah. Just yeah, passed. You almost made it. You know what I'm saying? I know. Right. Thank you God. Yo, Taurus? I can't stand Taurus. Oh, they just suck. Right. Sit down. You can't say no. I'm Taurus. You said no. You're good. I'm Taurus. You a Taurus? Okay, no. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I can't stand him. That, that ex was a Taurus. We are the most loyal people on the planet. My mother's a Taurus. No, y'all. So you don't like your mom? She is. Your mom's Wow. What's happening here? Yeah. That's a whole nother show. Uh, yeah, that's not <laughs> That's something you see, else. See, I got quiet. Like, you don't believe me. I'm a Scorpio. I'm a Scorpio. Yeah. Yeah. That's why. Yeah. That's exactly why. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 So, I, I understand now. Math versus Remy. M-O-E, Chrome nah, 23, so, Columbus. No, nah, so. it needs to be a song. Yeah, you want it. Like, nah, you go with that song on record. You're not going to say here, Math loves me. Math loves, he likes to talk to me. He likes to fucking try to pick my brain. He wants to try to stump <laughs> me all day. Like, this is his favorite thing to do. I don't even think I've seen anybody this close in period of time on show twice. Like, I, I haven't. Nah, you are there. Yeah, I give that to you. I give that to you. But I'm also supporting what you're doing. I feel yeah. like battle rap needs to return to New York, and what you're doing is yeah. is cultivating it again. Like, and being somebody who was here from when it started, right? I miss it. So being that you're bringing it back, I got to support that. And that's that. exactly why you didn't do my car, right? and now I'm leaving. That's right! <laughs> that's right! Run, run, run. Your mic, your mic. Fuck this mic. I need 75,000, yeah. You reminds me again. 75,000, yeah. He gave me a hard time, and now I'm leaving. Go. This hot fuck. Trap, trap, and turn smack rapper. Only smack rapper that you know is smack rappers. Got bars, I can hang with the backpackers. Trap star, I don't hang with the backpackers. I'm in the hood with the...
the work you heard. Making fiends leave earth you heard. Got your baby mama thirst you heard. Feel the flow, nigga, throw it in reverse. This the wave you need to surf you heard.